Are we ready to hit start on this thing? I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be able to see anyone's health, anyone's name, the names of any spells. <laughs> I don't know whether to laugh or cry. I'm assuming this is new game. And then, oh my god, the white mage is Ollie! That's so cute! Hang on, I'll move my camera so you can see these. I didn't realize that my camera would be covering this up. I mean, I also had no idea what the surprise was, so... <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> this is the... I'm assuming the fighter, and this is the white mage, which I'm pretty sure is definitely 100% my parrot. And, um, we obviously have to have a black mage now because holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> Yo, yeah, this has got to be the work of Techie. <laughs> this has got to be Techie's work. 100%. How did y'all do this? How, how did, how did you, how did you do this? I don't even know. I legitimately have no idea how you changed the sprites. That's magic. And, um, I, I, I love you guys. Thank you. <laughs> Can we get, uh, we're, don't worry. I'm gonna look at the rest of the sprites, but can we please get some extra big heckin' love in the chat for Christo and Tekitume who put this together for me to play Wingdings Final Fantasy. But not just Wingdings, but with special add-ons. <laughs> that, this is incredible. Oh my god, look at Monk Me! Look at Monk Me, I'm so cute. Oh, and then red- Oh, dude. Red mage me. Also good. Here, I'll hide my camera so you can see all six at the same time. This is so good! I don't even know what to say. How am I supposed to choose, y'all? How am I supposed to choose from this? They're all so good! <laughs> Four black mages, says Weeva. <laughs> I feel like we gotta have at least one red mage. Okay, I'm gonna bring my camera back. I got, oh my god, I have to decide. This is too hard. Okay, so this, all right. So the one on the, the top left is Fighter Spoonie. This one's Fighter Spoonie. This one must be Thief Spoonie. Monk Spoonie, aka Monkey. <laughs> and then we have Red Mage Spoonie. We have Ollie as a White Mage. And we have Googly Eyed Checks Black Mage. <laughs> Intern Spoonie was Black Mage until we switched it to Googly Eyes. Oh my god, that's also an adorable sprite. I love them oh, both wait. so much. <laughs> this is so perfect. Like, don't, don't mind me being incredibly touched that y'all went like super out of your fucking way to make this. <laughs> Also, no, Cody, I don't think we're ever escaping the googly eyes. I'm super sorry. 
We love you though! Twin, yeah, no torture, only fun. Hi, Gambling Cohen, how are you doing today? Also, hi, Solid, I hope you had a good vacation. It's great to see you back. Mm, I don't know what to pick. I feel like we should definitely have at least one melee character, so. Let's go with Monkey for sure. I really think, I, I really kind of am leaning towards the party that Acrystra was recommending, which is Monk, Red Mage, White Mage, Black Mage. I'm really leaning towards that. I mean, Thief and, and Fighter are also very, very good sprites. Oh my god, what are the- <gasps> Yo, I just realized something. What do the evolved versions of their sprites look like? <laughs> what? How do you evolve this? <laughs> How do you evolve this? <laughs> I can't wait to see this. I can't wait to see this. It's gonna be so good. Oh Jesus, I'm crying just thinking about it. Okay. So what do y'all think? Hey chat, does this seem like a good a good party? Monk, red mage, white mage, black mage. Does this seem like like will this be reasonable to me with the fact that I won't be able to read diddly squat? Nothing about this is fucking reasonable, says Tropical Freeze 21. Y'all, you know it's bad when Trop says that this is unreasonable. <laughs> when your good friend Trop says this shit ain't reasonable, you must be going in a direction. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> so, here's the thing. The Pixel Remaster will let me input names with letters. So, y'all know what we have to make the party, right? Y'all realize that we can only make one party. Do you want me to tell you? Do you want me to tell you what it is? I mean, I'm sure you can guess. Spoonie can't read wing. <laughs> Spoonie doesn't play games, but Spoonie can't read wingdings is better. It's better. It's better. Spoonie doesn't play games versus Spoonie can't read wingdings. <laughs> Okay, this is our, our, um, party, I guess. <laughs> this is a terrible fucking idea, let's go. Oh my god, though, the music. <laughs> Story about Final Fantasy 1. 
One day, the big castle wanted to fight the big sand tower. Um, also coming along, though, was this one village. Yes, that's right. In Final Fantasy One, everything is sentient. Also, holy shit, the intro music's really loud. <laughs> Uh, then there's also this cave, and it is full of disgusting swampy swamp, 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 fuck you, swamp, swamp, zombies, tentacles. Fancy 3D castle. And then one day, um, everyone decided that being able to read was just too cursed, so they decided to cut that shit out and make everything wingdings. <laughs> also, y'all know how there's Zodiac in Final Fantasy XIV? Well, the origin of that was Final Fantasy I being hella cursed, and there's a whole bunch of Zodiac symbols. Gotcha. Elon, you love that people coming into the stream will think, oh yeah, they'll think that I can read Wingdings really well and never realize that we named the characters Spoonie Can't Read Wingdings. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so here's some, some very lovely helpful instructions if you don't know how to play. <laughs> In case, uh, in case you didn't know how to play, don't worry. Final Fantasy wants got you. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> this is quite possibly the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Overworld sprites. Okay. Listen, these are all great. Oh my god, I have pigtails. <gasps> Look! Oh my god, Ollie has tail feathers! <laughs> Yo, this is so good! <laughs> I guess we should go talk to the king. I'm sure he'll have something important to tell us, right? Yep, um, I understand this. <laughs> um, yep, uh, we got these crystals. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. I, yes, uh, yeah, I totally understand that. Yeah, your, your daughter, Princess Sarah, she's in a castle. She's been kidnapped. Oh, wow, look at us. We're the warriors of light. We're so cool and awesome. I guess we better go rescue your daughter from that pesky garland who will knock us all down. <laughs> oh my God, the eyes jiggle. They bounce up and down. <laughs> Oh, I'm fucking dead! <laughs> I can't breathe! The eyes of jiggle physics! I feel like we were supposed to collect some loot here, if I remember right. There's loot here, right? Uh, I think. <laughs> or or can we not get the loot until after we go beat up Garland? I don't remember. Yeah, that's why I was like, I think I have to beat up Garland first. And then they're like, here's the key. That old man will help. 
Oh God. Uh, okay, I was like, which one's the save? <laughs> All right, um, <clears throat> first things first. Oh, that, that's right, there are no rows. We're fine. What? <laughs> I don't, is this items? Okay, that's items, got it. Wait, why does the monk have a staff? What? Why does the monk have a staff? Excuse me? No. How do I unequip? Is this nothing? Do I have nothing equipped now? I don't know what this means. Okay, I think, I think that must be the nothing. Cool. We have the nothing equipped now, good. spells are either. It's 
gonna be great. Also, oh, there's no peninsula power to level up on, but that's okay. We might have enough money to start buying some stuff. I'm gonna see. Oh, hey, here's the old guys to teach us things. <laughs> I don't know what you're asking me. Yeah, so wise. That'll help a lot. Yo, this music is really good remastered, though. Holy hell. Okay, at least we have the symbols of the actual weapons. Okay, I definitely want to buy a hammer for the white mage. I don't want nunchucks, because they suck. Uh... I don't know what I'm buying. <laughs> been an issue in any version of Final Fantasy that I've played, Nick. I believe that's only the NES version where they would attack a dead target. <laughs> so don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, okay. <clears throat> I bought some stuff. I don't know what that stat- I think that's magic defense. <laughs> Or maybe evasion? I don't know! Uh, I have a hammer. Sure. I'm thinking it must be evasion. Alright, let me go up here and take a look at our spells. Yeah, which weapon's better? Hmm. Oh my god, look, y'all! All, oh, all the white mages are Ollie. That's so cute. <laughs> oh god, uh. <laughs> Yeah, this one, this one must be Dia because only the white mage can learn it. I don't know what this spell is. Question. In the Pixel Remaster of Final Fantasy 1, can you delete spells that you buy? Or are you stuck with it? No, it can't be Blink, because the Red Mage can also use Blink. You can delete. Okay, that's good. <laughs> and the PS1 version, or at least that I remember, I couldn't delete them, so I had to be very careful about things. Uh, 
Yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm just not gonna buy those for now. But I swear, I feel like... I don't know what the flag is. I don't know. I guess I'm just not gonna buy it. I don't even know how much money I have. then this would also maybe be an F, and I don't know what else starts with F that we get at this point? Uh... Dude, I don't know. I, we're just gonna have to try some spells. This is terrible. I don't know what anything says. Uh, don't worry about it. I, I'm sure this will be fine. Yeah, the last one had a snowflake. It must be Blizzard. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to try out some spells. Okay, that one's an AoE spell. Oh my god, when he's casting the blue eyes. Definitely want that. All right, that's definitely Dia. And we do have Cure. All right, so I bought Fire, Thunder, and Sleep for the Black Mage. I don't know what that other Black Mage spell is. But we do have one more spot. We could try to find out. This version has spell slots. We have one more spot for white magic. Mm. I don't know what this is, but it's white mage only, so I'm gonna grab it. I don't, yeah, I don't remember what level ice is at. But 
I'm gonna grab, I wanna say that's probably like poison or something. I'm gonna grab that for the red mage. And we'll see. We'll see how this goes. I don't even know what level we are. I have no clue. All right, so let's figure out what that spell is. And also that spell. I don't know what that means. Is that that spell that lowers their evasion? Dope, oh my God, and that's blank. Aw, oh, sick. Or invis, maybe. I think you get invis sooner and then you get blank or something like that. Because I think Red Mage only gets one of them, but that's definitely one we 100% want. We super duper want that spell. Goodbye. Good purchase. Yo, yeah, what's weird is I swear my Red Mage eventually was able to learn... Oh, wait! Oh, I think it was Red Wizard that can learn Blink. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Uh, hey Chad, does anybody know what the heck that spell was that the red mage cast on the imps that was just like a spotlight? I have no clue what that was. I don't know what that spell is. I think that's the thing that lowers their evasion maybe? Is that is that fog? I don't know. I don't know if I ever used fog. Yeah, of course that black mage has seen things. Have you seen how big his eyes are? How could he not see things? that I learned, because Dia, uh, red mages can't use Dia. Only white mages get it, at least at this point in the game. Oh, plus the spell that the red mage used was a black magic spell. Uh, it's this one. <laughs> Whatever this means. Maybe it's fog? Because, all right, if the symbols are the same, because this one is fire, so if that means that the pointing hand is an F, then that would mean, maybe mean it's like me focus butter. or fog? Give me the butter. Boris, thank you so much for gifting out 10 subs to the community. Welcome on in to Oni Sensei. Jason finds pizza. It's Michi obvious. is dead. He cast Virgo. <laughs> he cast Virgo. <laughs> Lunar Wordsmith, Snack Attack, Maru Sees, Sunfell, Skyraker, Dimiti, and Lamtron Shu. I hope y'all enjoy 30 days of emotes courtesy of Forest. Thank you so much. Also, did y'all know that that gets us our next awesome August goal? Did y'all know that we just hit our next awesome August goal? Which means I, Spoonie, will be playing Pokemon Emerald as a randomizer Nuzlocke. I've never played Pokemon Emerald or a Pokemon Nuzlocke or a Pokemon randomizer. Yay! <laughs> so that's gonna be happening in September. No, oh my god, 
gosh, not in Wingdings. Moral, you're trying to kill me. <laughs> Listen, I can at least do Final Fantasy and Wingdings, like, and sort of hobble my way along because I've played through this game a couple of times. But I've never played, I've never played oh, Emerald, and I certainly have not played Pokemon enough to do it in Wingdings. Uh, now, let me mark uh, over here on our subathon page that we have officially met the 1100 point sub goal. Thank you all so much for the support. I really appreciate it. Our next goal is going to be at 1200 sub points. So in 99 sub points, I will play Power Washing Sim, which is uh, gonna be then a whole stream of me washing things and going It'll be fun. <laughs> if you're interested in seeing what some of the other awesome August incentives are that we have yet to unlock, you can type exclamation point subathon. There's a big list of them at the bottom of that pastebin page or exclamation point August if you want that page, it has them as well. Um, but yeah, this, this subathon is pretty much like the last three days for anybody who wants to help make any of those incentives happen. Hi, Anervite. How are you doing? Okay, it is focused. Cool. Thank y'all. I was pretty sure that that is. Who, me, Chaos? Am I a mad woman? I don't know. I just do dumb stuff. Is that madness? <laughs> okay, well good, we got another level. I think we're level four? I don't know if that's high enough level to go punch Garland, but we're gonna try. I'm trying to remember, uh, hey chat. Do y'all recall at all, at this point in the game, are we able to access any of the other treasure chests here? I'm also trying to remember if there's a way to do AOE magic in Final Fantasy 1 that I'm forgetting. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's the right side you need the elf key. The left side we can. Cool, thank you. I figure I'm gonna have a hard enough time just reading shit, so I don't mind asking. New people coming in to see Final Fantasy will, yeah, they'll be very confused. But maybe intrigued. Whether or not you got AOA spells later or something. Oh god, no! The Black Mage died! He looks so sad! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I don't have any revive spells either. That's not good. I don't know what the hell I just picked up. Stuff. Oh, we're gonna open the chest and then we'll head back to town. Da-da-da-da-da! Oh, for, for anyone curious, because I think I saw somebody asking what language this is. This is in Wingdings. This is Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings. Oh my 
my gosh, Ollie casting is so cute. Oh no, we're fine. We're we're fine. We're fine, Chris. We're, we have a white mage. We're fine. We're totally fine. It can't paralyze all of us. custom sprites. Oh, my first one was also Final Fantasy VI to Bad Bad. That was the first video game I ever played. Okay, so we're gonna leave Garland's Castle, though, because poor Wingdings has just freaking ripped it. Um, and we're gonna head back to town because we're gonna have to revive Wingdings. We'll now unfortunately be a bit behind in XP, which is not the best for a black mage. Just have to get him XP later, it's fine. I don't want to run from any fights this early in the game. church or whatever to revive a dead party member or does the end do it I don't even know where that is in the first town oh gosh because I don't see an icon on the map for where it is oh oh it's right okay I was like, dude, I'm pretty sure I have to do that in this version, but there wasn't an actual mark for it on the map. Okay, cool. Because I actually, I don't know if I've played a version of Final Fantasy 1 where you didn't have to do that. Are there any versions like that? Thank you, Chad. Yay! Hey, <laughs> we're not dead. Hi, Zaru. Uh, it's going pretty great. Techie and a quiz store also surprised me with custom sprites. <laughs> so it's pretty fantastic. Yeah, there might be Phoenix Downs, Grin, although I will have no idea how to tell which one is a phoenix down. <laughs> I won't be able to tell. And I would say, oh, well, I could go by how expensive it is, but I don't know what the price is either. Oh, shoot. You know what? I probably should actually try to go buy some potions real quick, considering this version does have empty charges. So actually, before I venture back to Garland's castle and try to actually knock down Garland, maybe we should go buy some potions. Remastered music is just all bangers. My 
childhood is soaring right now. Okay, so let's swing by the item shop and try to, I don't know, maybe decipher what some of this is. I know that these are tents! <laughs> Sleeping bag, tent. Um... Potion? I bought 10 potions. Oh, and now I can't afford a tent. Shoot. Okay, so that must mean, I think potions are 50 gil each in Final Fantasy 1, so we like, yeah, we would have only had enough to buy like one tent anyway. I don't think I particularly need to worry about buying tents just yet. Tents are gonna be really important when we go to the caves. Um, to pick up, uh, yeah, I forget what it's called. But it's the cave that has all the Pisco demons that I hated as my full white mage party because it took me like 20 freaking hours to get through it. Hi, Paladin Boris. Actually, this is really fun so far. <laughs> Hi, how are you doing today? All right, so we're in front of Garland's castle again. Let's go. Oh, Sarah's sprite's so pretty. I, Garland, will knock you all down? Somewhere in there. Oh. Oh, okay, this is really, really good. a really pretty sprite. Yay, we saved your daughter. Uh, fix that bridge, please. Hi, Ollie. What you doing? <laughs> Cool, thank you for uh, fixing the bridge. Uh, I got something. Uh, I got a key item that I don't remember what it is. It's probably important. I'm gonna go talk to this old man. 
if I can remember how to get up there and, and take all this treasure. I want the treasure. Give me the treasure. I think I have to go on the outside? Do you have anything for us? I don't remember. I don't think you do yet. I think that's after the L stuff. gives us yeah that guy probably did have something important to say but we just won't know what it is construction for the bridge so long and thank you for the bridge I need MP charges <laughs> yeah she gives you a key item paladin Boris I think it might be like the loot or something I feel like she gives you something that you don't actually need for a really long time. But you talk to her and she's like, oh my god, thank you for saving me. And then she gives you a thing and that's why it made the da 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 I don't know how to get to key items because it's windings, but... Uh... Stats. Yeah, I guess this would be a key item. I don't know what this is, but we have it. <laughs> we can talk to those four old guys for beginner tips. Yeah, that we can't read. <laughs> Whoa! Y'all, look at that fade. And so, the brave warriors of light, after saving the Princess Sarah, go forth in their quest to figure out why are there so many monsters? Will anyone ever speak a language they understand? How much money and health do they have? I don't think we'll ever know. <laughs> yeah, this might be one of the most cursed things that I've ever had on my stream. <laughs> Let's go. 
Yeah, we don't have a boat yet. Let's see, we don't want to go to the desert at all. It was this way to the Peninsula of Power before. What even happens up here now? Hi, Ollie. I mean, honestly, Christopher, thank you for giving me cursed ideas that are hilarious. I did not even consider the idea that I could, in fact, try to play this game in Wingdings until you mentioned it. I don't think we can talk to Matoya yet. I don't remember. Or maybe we are supposed... I don't even remember when you're supposed to talk to Matoya. Maybe it's now. Because there's a cutscene. I don't know what she's saying the to me. Bouncer. <laughs> she's saying the bouncer. <laughs> Thank you, Boris, for the 150 bouncer bits. Also, we're gonna take her stuff, and she's gonna yell at me later for taking her stuff, but it's fine because I won't be able to understand her. Welcome to Final Fantasy Cursed. <laughs> How are you doing today? That side can't stop me because I can't read. <laughs> that has never been so applicable, Miss Nintendo Chick. In this run, Boris, we have a monk, a red mage, a white mage, and a black mage. I decided to go with monk because you don't really have to spend much money on them. And I figured I should give myself one easy character, considering the other three are mages that I have to decipher what the hell all the magic is. What are the games can you swap in wingdings for? Well, Tonberry, um, as far as we know, swapping the font for wingdings should work for all of the other Final Fantasy Pixel remasters. Also, I'm not entirely sure why Ollie is like climbing down my arm right now. Hi, what is it? What, do you want to sit on my leg? Definitely gonna be using sleep on the pirates today too, 100%. Crystal. It's 
game is hard enough to learn on Weijing's the first time. Why would you rearrange the font? Hello, Ollie. Hi. Yes. Hi. All right, let's see. What magic can I buy here? It's level two. I know that much. Yeah, I have no clue. I don't, I don't, I don't know what these are. I'm gonna go to the black magic store first. the others are yet. Uh, I feel like I had another snowflake symbol that was maybe a T? Yeah, so the snowflake is a T, I think. with a T that's not thunder. <laughs> Obviously need it. We're gonna give that to my red mage. Um, sure, I guess I'll buy a better weapon for my red mage too while I'm at it. something in one of those that I found. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
That's like the only equipment I have. I don't need that. And this is a tent. So I have a tent. <laughs> I have a single tent, y'all. Woo! Hi, Crimson. Yeah, these are wingdings. Welcome to wingding Final Fantasy 1. Okay, I am definitely in need of more money for this place. Also, I don't know if we're really ready to fight the pirates yet. So, time to do some more grinding. try to remember all of it instead. Oh god, I do have single digit health. That's not good. I forgot that I didn't actually stay at an inn. <laughs> this is fine. These unicorns hit really hard. My monk is glass cannon right now. Choices, Crimson. Broken game file I refuse to set down, I guess. <laughs> okay, um, I have no idea how much money these are dropping, but I'm trying to make sure that I can afford some armor. Oh, shoot. <gasps> Unless I can't get to the armor store before we fight the pirates, but I don't remember. But either way, we definitely still need money still. Hey, Time Wander. Thanks for bringing full silver. How you doing? Hi. We're here to kill chaos, but in wingdings. Why would the Black Mage not have giant googly eyes? Why not? That's the question we always ask around here. Why not? Hey, Jess. How are you doing? No, Boris. I, I don't have the raid video in wingdings. <laughs> Please no kill my black mage, thank you. Please, uh, please. Oh my god! <gasps> Look at hurt black mage. That is disturbingly cute. <laughs> and I am out of cures, so I'm gonna go back and I am going to stay at the end. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, googly-eyed black mage, definitely big cute. Hi, Lewis. Hi, Awesome. How are y'all doing? <laughs> Welcome. Hi, I'm Spoony, by the way. <laughs> Today, you have entered my stream as I am playing Final Fantasy 1's Pixel Remaster in Glorious Wingdings. Also, all of the 
character sprites for our party are custom made by one of our lovely community members. And my goal is to beat this game in Wingdings. And if your question is why, then my answer is why not. I can. We're also doing a subathon for this weekend, celebrating Awesome August, which is me celebrating six years of streaming on Twitch. It's pretty dope. So if you see a timer below my Kungwe and Green Parrot Ollie's camera there, that is how much time we have left on the timer. Um, I do some of those a little bit differently than you might be used to if you've seen them around on Twitch. I used to do subathons in one sitting where we do up to 24 hours, but then as the years went by, I realized I love sleep. <laughs> so instead, I do subathons over multi days. So the clock can go up to 36 hours total and it will be across the whole weekend. Egg! Definitely earned this one. Googly eyed make cast for the win. I do love googly eyes. I still feel a little bit bad for Belle because I feel like we're accidentally torturing him with the googly eyes. Thank you, Crimson, for four months. Welcome back, I appreciate that. Uh, if you're curious how you can add time to the subathon, or if you're curious about any of our wonderful, awesome August incentives, which unlock at every 100 sub point goals that are above my head there, you can type exclamation point subathon and click on the paste bin link. Hi, Danny, thank you. How are you doing? Also, welcome back, Badger. Yeah, I don't really know how much money I have. Um, I'm just sort of... What do you call a parade of rabbits <laughs> hopping backwards? A receding hairline. Thank you, Forrest, for the 500 biddies and the pun. <gasps> oh my god, has Brian not seen them? Uh, excuse me while I open Discord in the background so I can I can DM him. Alright, I just DM'd him and I said he definitely needs to come see the sprites tech he made for the Wingdings run when he can. <laughs> They're so good. Wait, what is I don't remember what the second Oh yeah, that's right. Temper, that's right, that's right, that's right. I picked up temper. It's a good buy. We're gonna want that for our monk friend. Monkey. <laughs> for anyone curious what our character names are, by the way, it's Spoonie Can't Read Wingdings. Dude, that 200 punch is dope. New idea, the bouncer, but all the voice actors are spoken wingdings. How on earth do we make spoken wingdings, Chop? Hi, Cobra, how are you doing? I feel like this has got to be enough grinding for money by now, right?
This has gotta be enough for now. Yeah, I'm not talking to the pirates yet. I'm gonna go buy some armor. <laughs> Maybe? Uh, are these gloves? I think these are gloves. Two, three, or four. <laughs> this is so confusing. I love it. I don't even know what this accessory does, but we're equipping it because we can. Thank you, Ash, for the 100 biddies. This PSA is brought to you by your local adventurers guild. Remember to avoid equipping your monks and black belts with any sort of weapon. They do, in fact, love being barehanded. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they, they appreciate the, uh, the rights to bear arms. Mm -hmm. Sandbar, sand bear arms, specifically. You feel like you'd read, oh yeah, like what the shapes, what you think the shapes are. I think they're leather gloves, I don't know. Sorry, I have, um, I have, like, cat hair on my face or something. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, where is the cat hair on my face? Don't know if I found it, but I feel better now, so. Why can't a nose be 12 inches long? Because then it would be a foot. for the 500 biddies. I don't know what any of these items are. Antidotes. I don't think they are. They must not sell them yet. I'll just buy a few extra tents, I guess. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, no problem, Charlie. I'll just read the description. That's that's a good point. <laughs> Kuro, how are you doing today? Uh... Yeah, I, I just- I don't know what any of this means. That has an A at the end of it. Maybe that's poison or something? <laughs> I, I bought it, whatever it was, I bought it and it can't hurt us anymore. I hope I have enough money to stay in the end. Okay, thank goodness. I really was concerned that I wouldn't actually have enough Thoth, how are you doing today? Alright, I'm gonna go save and then we're gonna try to fight the pirates and see how it goes. I think we might be okay because of the fact that we do have sleep.
I do remember which one it is, because it's the only one in the level one that targets all enemies. Yeah, it's the only one I bought that targets everything. Galaxy Brain. Also, how come the pirates kind of look like Vikings? Alright, well, we put several to sleep. That should help. than I remember them being. <laughs> uh, pirates say some stuff. Give me canoe. Or boat. I don't know. I got a boat. Yeah. Give me the boat. Thanks for the boat. Drop, do you want me to read that out loud? I will, because you're my friend. But only if you ask. Eyeballs are not very friendly. See? Told you they're not friendly. to point out the fact that in order to make all of these sprites work, Techie also had to make sprites for low health, no health, being attacked, attacking, casting a spell, running away. There are a lot of them. And also there will be upgraded versions of these later. Where did Noah keep his bees? In the archives. I think... I got hives from that joke. <laughs> Thank you for the 500 bits for it. Single us. class has 10 modified sprites, plus an overworld sprite sheet with 10 more sprites. There are 12 classes. 
Teki drew 240 sprites. Bard love Teki to me. 240? Are you serious? There's 240? for the 250 biddies. Hi, Venom. This is Wingdings. Do you like it? <laughs> you like it? <laughs> okay. Monkey is back alive again. No, he's not, because I forgot to go to the church! <laughs> Alright, I don't know where it is here. Shoot. Hands don't raise the dead. Spend more money, because you forgot that. Hands do not raise the dead. You forgot to ask earlier, do we lose a goal if the total falls back under the threshold? Absolutely not, Rock. Because that would be kind of evil. <laughs> I may not be able to control how many sub points fall off from previous months of gift subs, but I sure as hell am not going to take incentives away from y'all. <laughs> Absolutely not. Whatever gets unlocked, you keep it. You can't stop me cause I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat and I'm going fast and nothing bad will happen cause I'm the protagonist man. Thank you boys for the 300 bits. I mean, I feel like a vacation at the Holiday Inn with some necromancers would be pretty exciting, don't you? Where do you take someone who's been injured in a peekaboo accident? To the ICU. Yep. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna stare into the middle distance and choose the wrong spells. <laughs> Thank you, Force, for the 500 bits. I mean, you know me, Akristor. Wing Dings, I can handle. Dad jokes. I've never told a dad joke in my life. Also, does the white mage have triple digit health now, but none of the other characters do? That's hilarious. Oh, 
Well, I guess Monkey technically does. talk to Matoya or not. Water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water. water. Scorpius, Leo, Cancer, Libra, Cancer, Scorpius, Leo, Cancer, Libra, Frowning Face, Scorpius. Frowning Face, Scorpius. Tier two. Welcome back. Hi. How are you doing today? Yeah, I don't think we can. I think we have to get the elf stuff done and talk to Matoya. Hi, Atma. Number the keyboard is. Also, I can land here, but I don't think that I necessarily wanted to. I haven't played this game since like January, so I'm trying to remember where I'm supposed to go right now. Probably down south? Oh yeah, just, yeah, I'll just ask the NPCs. I'm sure they'll remind me where to go. We were just praising you over the absolutely bonkers level of dedication and work you put into making this a thing. symbol is the S for enemies. But what's interesting though is that <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh my god. I just realized. Hang on. Are the capital letters different? Are the capitalized letters different? Dude, that's why. Why the S for Spoonie is different than the S for Sahagen. <laughs> Finally understand. I mean, if you want to add a googly eyed boat, Techie, I won't say no. But there is zero pressure to do that either. You've already made so much. <laughs> is the black, yeah, the black mage is googly eye. <laughs> Isn't it great? Don't you love it? Well, well, nobody can stop me but me, but I won't stop me. Okay, 
Okay, this is not good. May I please become unparalyzed? Okay, thank goodness. We got monkey back up. Oof. I forget that these water fights are really rough. Oh good, we got some levels though. That's a plus. monkey back up from the ground as oh good we got monkey back up yeah that is a definitely a different but also awesome statement <laughs> okay I think I'm now officially out of magic charges for heals this is fine um I think we're supposed to go to the ice cave now I don't remember I'm just going. helping him with the surprise or it would give it away. The only thing I could really think of was the possibility of y'all changing the sprites, but I wasn't really sure if that was possible or any idea of what they would look like. Oh yeah, hey, uh, lolly ho! I assume. <laughs> I think I need to talk to one of you about something. Yeah, I have, I have no clue if I was supposed to talk to any of these folks right now or if it's not so later. But I'm gonna go down this way just in case. You found the boats! <laughs> oh man! <laughs> yeah, here's where we need the dynamite, which I think we get from the Earth of Cave, maybe? Yeah, we don't have the key to open that door yet. Okay, so we can't do anything here yet. I mean, really, I think so far the whole stream is just pure chaos. I don't even know what items I'm getting from these chests. I have no idea. 
I can't read anything. Is it armor? Is it a hat? Is it a suitcase? A pancake? I don't know. I know nothing. I have not done the dramatic prairie dog yet. Oh my god, Techie, you're right. What am I what am I even doing with my life if I'm not gonna do this, right? Hang on. <clears throat> I got this, alright? Just give me a sec here. We're gonna make it happen, Captain. make the sucker bigger. We're gonna do it live, okay? We're doing it live. We're doing it live. No, enhance more. Nah, a little bit more. A little bit, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Ah, yes, that's a good size. That's a good size. Thank you, Techie. <laughs> when is that going to be an alert? Uh, the second that Trop is willing to and has the time to make me a GIF of that and someone sends me the .ogg file and I figure out what it will be an alert for. I don't know what alert that would be. <laughs> I keep forgetting that it works if you just make it an MP4 with the sound, because I'm so used to uploading them separately. Also, hey Trap, do you still have editor? Or did you lose it again when I joke banned you and I forgot to give it back to you for months like usual? Uh oh. We are potions. Well, we're not curious. We have some potions. Was that like 99? <laughs> one one? I don't know what that means. Oh, one way to be sure. Joke ban him again. Of course. It is a good number. Um, ice cave. 
No, I won't though, because I don't want to have to re-add you as editor again, Trop. Because I will forget for another nine months until I Joe fan you again. <laughs> How are you feeling, fighter? Not bad, about two folders right now. <laughs> Hi, Paul, how are you doing today? I did it? See, that's what I was worried about is that I never actually re-added you as an editor. <laughs> is there actually a way to do that? Is there like a chat command for that? Yeah, I can't go through that yet. <gasps> the money pirates. tents or something. That seems like a smart plan. is here I'm pretty sure yes is I don't know is it church here Rick frack I hope so please revive my friend do the elves believe in necromancy <laughs> Significantly better now that we are here at the Elf City. <laughs> we could buy a dagger for the Black Mage. Hmm. 
I'm gonna buy a better sword for Red Mage. And I'm gonna hold off, though, on buying the dagger. Oh my god, I have no idea what the other stat is. Bring it. Probably accuracy. <laughs> Who needs accuracy? Pshhh. Accuracy is for nerds. Hello, Uru. Uh, welcome to Spoonie is playing Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings. And also, Techie made like 260 sprites to change and customize all of our party members for us. So they are also Spoonie themed, which is pretty fucking fabulous if you ask me. All right, time to figure out what the hell this is. Fun. Thundaga! This is Thundaga! Buying it. Oh my god. That was open folder, close folder, close folder, close folder level of money. That was a thousand gil. <laughs> I'm broke now! But I know Thundaga. Yeah, these are all a thousand gil. And I don't know what any of them do. <laughs> but that's fine. We can grind out more money. Oh, yeah. Also, this is where I think, like, Link's grave or something is here. But we can't read it, so. Doesn't this elf city have, like, two? wizard stores it do and these are worse these are 2500 <sighs> I definitely can't afford this I think the top one was silence All right, cool. Game saved. Have a good night, Bob. Thank you for joining us. You rest well. Oh, I'm not 100% sure that it is actually 2,500, my other Nick. It could be more than that. I just know that it's a four digit number. <laughs> it's higher than a thousand. <laughs> I I think it's a five, but I don't know what the first number is exactly. Yeah, I'm gonna grind out some money and XP because we don't have enough money to buy all the really good spells here. And I probably can't really afford to buy them all in general, but it would be a good plan for me to start buying some. But see, this is definitely Thundaga or Thundara, some kind of aura. Listen, it's an AoE thunder spell and that's what matters to me. Thunder girl burr. Fine, Blizzard technically goes burr, but <laughs> I don't have Blizzard yet. <laughs> Please do not hit the mage. Yo, that is disgusting and I love it. How much money do I have? A thousand something, I think? <laughs> 
I think I have a thousand something. <laughs> I don't know. because no one, none of us can read anything to hilarious because um, I can read things and I'm somehow managing to play through this. Resume after this playthrough is over, Techie, that I am semi fluent in wingdings. Okay, spent every penny I had on another Thundaga. Check. money to stay at the end. <laughs> hey, Mr. Tia, how are you doing? It's fine. I can take care of this with the dozen. the best. adults doing something useful I might as well do something not useful and keep us all sane enough so that the adults who are adults enough to do things that are useful can keep doing useful things instead of falling to madness that's the barred way Writer. Yeah, I would still see this as educational. <laughs> oh wait, I meant to use that. There we go. You know how sometimes at the end of a fiscal year you buy something that you probably, I don't know, like didn't necessarily have to buy. Like you didn't have to have it in that particular moment. But the end of the year was coming up and it was your last chance to buy something that you could technically use for business and would be tax deductible. I am that thing. I am the thing that you didn't really need, but is still useful in some weird way and is tax deductible. <laughs> I don't even know if that 
that just made sense. But I'm sticking to it. subscription to be on your taxes though i listen don't don't take tax advice from me okay i play video games and make stupid jokes for a living <laughs> i am definitely the last person you want to listen to about your taxes <laughs> changes to make sure this all worked that's some hecking dedication you've got enough on your mind during the workday storm you're looking for complete uselessness when you turn on twitch that's what i'm here for <laughs> life Peter Pan. Otherwise, the world just seems like it would be really heckin' boring. Hey, Electric Legend! Welcome! How are you doing today? Punch them. Attack and dethrone go! Leo, Cancer, Libra, Medium Square, Scorpius, Pencil. Medium Square, Libra, Pencil. <laughs> cool, thank you for 56 months at 2 3. Welcome back. Hi, how are you doing today? Do you, do you like this googly eyed black mage? Because I think it's pretty dope. Second star to the right and straight on till morning. You know what's funny? Um, Angry Trees and I were talking. This was like a few weeks ago. And he said, uh, we were talking about something and I don't remember what it was. But he just like stopped in the middle of a sentence and turned and looked at me and he said, you know what I just realized? You really are kind of a real life Peter Pan. <laughs> And I was like, you know, I never really thought of myself that way, but hell yeah, I'll take it. How, oh, we just started talking two weeks ago. How do we get married? Very carefully, Forrest. Very carefully. There was a good deal of back and forth with Tucky. He'd send a sprite pack and you'd test it. Some issues with the floating pixels occurred, but once you test... Had everything, you nuked your copy of FF1, did a clean install, and copied everything in. Holy damn. Like, seriously, I know, I know that I said this earlier, but can we just get, like, a bunch more love and chat for Chris Store and Techie for the amount of effort they put into making this even more ridiculous for me? This is some top fucking tier dedication. To memes. <laughs> okay, I don't quite have enough money yet. 
for any other spells. I don't remember what other spells they even have here, to be honest. Yeah, there's a mini-map in towns now. It's pretty awesome. I have no idea, Foreigner. Um, I can't read any of it, so I don't know who's buried there. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, why would the Black Mage have too much swag? Can you have too much swag, Yami? I don't think you can have too much swag. <laughs> swag, swag, swiggity swag, swag, swaggity, swiggity swag. <laughs> All right, we have been live for almost three hours. And I don't have anything else to drink, so I think I'm going to take a quick break here, and I'm going to stretch my legs. I, honestly, I think I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee. <laughs> Thank you all so much for joining me for the beginning of the subathon. This is already absolutely fantastic. I'm genuinely having a really good time with Wingding's Final Fantasy, and I am looking forward to figuring out what the rest of these spells are and, and where the hell to go because I don't remember. <laughs> Thank you all so much. Um, I'm going to be playing the awesome August infomercial while I am gone. So if you were curious what incentives you can still unlock during this last weekend of awesome August, stick around because boy, oh golly gee, do I have a 90s GeoCities themed infomercial to make you feel old. <laughs> and to inform you! And to inform you. <laughs> Don't go too far, or if you do, just come back, because there will be more wingding. <laughs> Hey there! My name is Spoonie, which most of you already know from, you know, twitch.tv slash products slash Spoonie underscore 3000, where we've got the raddest gifts and wiggly text on the web. We've even got a live visitor box. This month, we've decked out our site with a totally awesome interactive event. Awesome August! We have hidden Easter eggs, um, you know, pop-up ads so we can keep running our web. Yes, hello, my name is Lady McFancy Scarf. I'm sure you've heard of me. I'm incredibly rich. <laughs> I sure do love the World Wide Web. I, I love asking that Jeeves all of them. We tried to get a 3D section of the website, but someone didn't order the 3D glasses. Whatever. So, for 600 sub points, We'll be doing a streamy singles, which I know does sound a lot like Kraft macaroni and cheese, but you know what they say, macaroni's delicious, and so are all of these incentives. We'll be playing the Final Fantasy VI World Collide Randomizer. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be so much fun. I love being just like, LOL, random. <laughs> <laughs> For 700 sub points, we've got streamy singles of Banjo-Kazooie, Ekum Bokum. Am I right, ladies? For 800 sub points, I'm going to do a Pop-Tart tasting slash ranking stream, which means that we're going to take like, I don't know, 10, 20, 30, however many flavors of delicious Pop-Tarts there are, and we're going to put them up head to head, and I am going to explain to everyone why Frosted Strawberry is actually the best, okay? At 900 sub points, we've got Bad Slash Weird Game Night Offbeat PS1 Edition. That means I'm going to be playing a bunch of PlayStation 1 games that my friend chose. You know the PS1 Underground? They're going to be even more underground and offbeat than that. At a thousand sub points, we've got another streamy singles. Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remaster. Wingdings Edition! Because you know how much we all love Wingdings. That text is just so totally crazy i love it oh and also i'm definitely going to photoshop ollie 
in a hot tub because hot tub streams are so fetch right now. Yeah, fetch is not even a word right now. At 1100 sub points, we've got a streamy singles of Pokemon Emerald, Nuzlocke Ransomizer, LOL more ransom, penguins. <laughs> At 1200 sub points, I'm going to play Power Washing Sim. <laughs> At 1300 sub points, we're gonna have an 80s movie night because I mean, I know we all love the 90s, but the 80s were just like so low key cool. At 1400 sub points, Shuffler Night, BizHawk 2, number community edition. So, you know how the BizHawk Shuffler was a thing where the mod team actually got to choose like 50 games that I like played and I had no idea what they were and they were bouncing around like bounce, 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 seconds each it'll be like that except for all of you lovely viewers will be able to decide what i'm playing Egg. instead yay at 1500 sub points i'm going to do a green haired samus cosplay for the release of metroid dread which as some of you may know is the justin bailey skin from the original metroid so cool <laughs> at 1600 sub points We'll be doing a Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door run, except for we're going to do Flavio percent because listen, if you don't think that Flavio is the best companion in Thousand Year Door, then you just At 1700 points, we have another streamy singles of Garfield Kart Online. Everybody loves Garfield. I mean, I know that he's not nearly as good as Calvin and Hobbes, but come on, Garfield is so old school. And of course, we all want to drive with him. Ha ha ha, honk honk. At 1800 sub points, we have a Super Metroid randomizer playthrough. More ransom. Listen. How old were you when you found out Metroid was a girl? Let me know in our live visitor book below. At 1900 sub points, we have a Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core playthrough. It's like the original, but instead the protagonist has even spikier hair. At 2000 sub points, we have a YouTube video of me, Spoomy, me, smashing the GoXLR for everything that it's ever done to wrong me. And I'm sure that that is just going to be swell. So if you would like me to smash a piece of technology that has been haunting my dreams like an evil demon for the past three years, absolutely help us get there. <laughs> At 2100 sub points, we've got a Wand of Gamelon remake playthrough. Good. At 2200 sub points, we've got another streamy singles. Dude Bro Spoonie, sup, <laughs> is gonna play Fortnite with her friends Tropical Freeze and Jack Mango. Also, we get a new emote, everybody. <laughs> Everybody loves emotes. <laughs> At 2300 sub points, I'm going to um, act like a grandma. My see, my Nana, she used to love showing me these old games like Carmen San Diego and Pong. So I thought that we would do an old PC games nostalgia night where I dress up and I talk like this, like I'm a grandmother and we play all of my Nana's favorite old PC games. <laughs> It'd be so, 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 so. At 2,400 sub points, I'm gonna get a new tattoo. Y'all, I haven't gotten a new tattoo since like 1996. So this is a long time coming. <laughs> oh, also we'll get another new emote. At 2,500 sub points, I'm going to do a 100% playthrough of Final Fantasy X-2. 100%, that means that not only are we gonna get killer fashion and amazing combat, but we also finally get the true ending. <sighs> so worth. <laughs> At 2,600 sub points, we're going to do an educational stream, which I know everybody like hates school, right? But this will be cool school, okay? Stay in school, it's cool. <laughs> We're gonna do a stream about the evolution of memes. <laughs> so at 2800 sub points, I'm gonna be painting miniatures on stream, which means we'll buy like tiny little orcs and goblins and hobbits and other cool nerdy things. And we'll just like 
paint them up, you know? Instead of like this boring gray color, we'll make them colorful, just like me. <laughs> At 3,000 sub points, I'm gonna try a tang nut sandwich. Now, if you don't know what a tang nut is, it's this like really hip new thing that all the kids are eating. It's two pieces of white bread with mustard on one and peanut butter on another. And you smash it together like a PB&J, except for it's PB&M. And I have heard that it is something else. Um, nom 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 nom, yum. I'm not helping with that. And then at 5,000 sub points, which I know is for us, okay. But I had this long standing thing where if we hit 5,000 sub points, I will do a Baton Kaidos 100% playthrough, including the two weeks of literally sitting there staring at your screen waiting for a bottle of shampoo to evolve, which basically means that we'll have, oh my god, like they just came out with this too, picture in picture. We'll have a little picture in picture of that going on in the bottom right of the website. <laughs> it's gonna be so great. It'll be like an evolving web page patch, but with video games. Also, a couple of other events that are coming up. At some point, I, Foodie, am finally gonna do that cooking stream I owe y'all. Yay! I hope I don't burn it. And then on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, that's August 27th, 28th, and 29th, we'll be doing a multi-day subathon. So anyway, Awesome August is gonna be totally awesome, and I hope to see you all there. <laughs> Bye! Am I ever going to get paid? This is at least giving me credit for college, right? Alrighty, everybody, I am back. Thank you so much for waiting. I hope you had a nice break there. I hope you also enjoyed our lovely, awesome August infomercial. <laughs> also, thank you, Anonymous, for gifting a sub out to the community. Welcome on into Arizonauts. ready to keep playing Final Fantasy Wingdings! It's me, I'm ready. I... I am as ready as I'm gonna get. I feel like I should at least do some exploring while we're grinding out money. Just to kind of make sure that I even remember where to go. Thank you for the welcome back. I made coffee. <laughs> so I got coffee for this now. I'm gonna be all caffeined up. Fun 
Crunching sure is great. Need anything up that way? I have no clue. I love the new spell effects. These are great. Also, wow, we bonked the crap out of that wolf. Ba 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 ba. would agree with punching being great. Well, you don't punch other people. You just punch wolves. And, um... I don't know. Other stuff, I guess? <laughs> oh, boy. I've got bad memories of this place. Sure, nothing will go wrong in the marsh cave. Also, I like how you can talk to the bats, but you know, it doesn't matter for me because I can't understand anything they say. <laughs> Imagine being able to understand what bats say to you. from the elf town, which was a mistake. Hi, Minion Cell. I have no idea, because my game is in Wingdings. Yeah, I'm at least a couple folders. <laughs> I don't know what that translates to in numbers, but we're, we're pretty, pretty good, I guess. to the sultry sounds of crunching. It's a 
Good thing I healed Lingings. Dying horribly. Totes. Totes and goats. We're fine. Except for we got a surprise attack, so. <laughs> to get back to town. Like, I remember doing this without a mini-map and it was terrible. Ow! Okay, mon monkey is dead. Shoot. Well, it at least we made it back. We're gonna crunch our way over to the church because one of our friends died. Which super sucks, because I'm pretty sure it costs like 500 gold to revive someone. <laughs> anyway, let's go take a nap, because our peanut butter is too crunchy. anymore because you died. Where is the item shop? It's over this way. Crunch, 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 crunch. Okay, so the real question is, do I risk buying a spell and hoping <laughs> that it's poison? Or do I just try to figure out how the hell to buy an antidote? I assume it's got to be one of these that costs, uh, I want to say that's 60? But I don't know which one it is. I don't know which one it is. Oh, I thought that this was 50. Is it 40? Is it 40 for potions? I thought it was 50 for potions. I think that this one's antidote. Because antidotes usually... So wait, does that mean I have an antidote? Let's see, that's one. Two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, that's five. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, ten.
Well, luckily we only have one thing that looks like an antidote, so... Oh good, we have computer open folder antidotes. <laughs> Oh boy! Huh? <laughs> okay, uh, I gotta figure out how the hell to identify which one of these is Poisona or Isuna. And I just, I have no idea. I have no idea. And I also can't afford any of them. So I am definitely gonna need to grind money before we go back to Miss Cave. face but is a zodiac well it's also hard to tell because of the fact that the capital letters are different than the lowercase ones so i keep getting them mixed up it's, it's not good <laughs> You, how are you doing today? I mean, it is literally symbols, so. case A. Yeah, okay, yeah, and the peace sign has to be uppercase because this is attack. I don't know if it's Poisona or Isuna. I don't know. I'll have to collect a thousand gil and find out. be colon really oh no <laughs> I don't know uh, wingdings are magic uh, okay I have closed folder computer symbol blank piece of paper for money Let's see if that's enough to buy me, hopefully, Isuna or Poisona. I don't know which. I think that was the money. I thought, isn't the time below that? Oh, wait. No, you're right. Yeah, that is time. Because the snowflake is T. So, oh, geez. No, I don't have nearly enough money. I must have spent all that I had found. Hi, Indigo. Yep, we are playing Final Fantasy 1 in Wing Jinx. Yeah, it's a kid going, I have this many. <laughs> 
Snix. Okay, little Timmy. Your purchase comes out to 1,000 gil. I have this many money. Oh, um, sweetie, that's not enough. Go kill more things in the woods and come back when you have more, okay? Okay, thank you, elf lady. on the internet for a Tempest. <laughs> oh my god! Yay, I have a thousand money at least. Let's uh, see if we can figure out which one of these spells is some sort of get rid of poison. Well, it can't be this top one. It's a thumbs up. <gasps> Maybe that's Cura though. Oh my God, that might be Cura, which I will want. Oh, I'm sorry, Timmy, but you need 15 tickets to live. Okay, let's see. Something, something, A, something, A. <laughs> oh, man. Let me go look and see what... Okay, so the thumbs down is a D. And that funny looking H symbol is an I. So yeah, that's gotta be like Diara or something. Which makes that, yeah, this definitely makes this Cura. So wait, does this store even have Asuna or Poisona? Or is it called Isun or something? This one is white mage only. No, I don't think this is null shock because the 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 cancer symbol is in lowercase a. Yeah, there is a second shop, but I mean, I, I thought that the first shop was the one You'll that never sold it. it. Also broke my timer. <laughs> Fuck. Did it add anything into the timer? 
timer at all? I, I don't know if it did. Can <laughs> someone confirm to me whether that got added in? Four is holy fucking shit, man. That is... That is incredibly, incredibly kind. Thank you so much for gifting out a hundred subs to the community. Excuse me while I take a moment to read all of these, because that is a thing that I do. Welcome on in to Mr. Casual, Doc Xavier, Dusty No, Z-Man, Chrono, Boogie Fever, Fatior, Stern, Molaru, Inigo Montoya, Rel... Rob, Arcturian Mordio, Carl Von Weber, Forzair, Anakazi, Lifeless, Rybrads, Horse Jesus, that's a great name. <laughs> Draco Mage, Roz, Yo Yo Dave, Cadenar, Matt Hat, Shabby Siren, Roaring Buttocks. That's another really just fucking top tier name. <laughs> Kumar Wilson, Sensual, Kershirk, Sheber, Lunix, The Great DQ Tree, Serakek, General Goods, First American Manga. Ouija board. Oh my god, like Ouija Luigi. I love it. Jibs, Gallant, Erica D Man, Death by Yugu, Bashin Gaming, Uncanny Manatee, Rise Lasher, Carganite, Vocalist, Store Off, Orion Spacebar, Ryoko Istar, Arc Argadon Prime. Sorry, I, had I was like, wait, is there an and in there? Is that all one word? Sometimes I can't read. It's fine. That's why I'm playing the game in Wingdings. <laughs> Complex Suplex, Moral Reef, Ninja Panda, Elrinia, The Onis, Jimmy Von Jr., Mountain Poo. Oh my god, that's another cute name. <laughs> Josh Camera, Sir Descry, Blutmort, Yuna, CK Moly, Carton Deuce, Uga Ghost, Matra Magic, Matt, Peatman, Kaju, Acid Orchid, Kiders, Gerbil, Final Light, Grace and the Bard, Windy Moo Princess, Peepo Mage, The Nano Pirate, Nanohama Leet, Yukin, Evil Genius, Ink Knight, Some Random Name, Cynix, Animaniac, Silver Slicer, Muffin Panda, Impure, Just Hayden, Awkward Bancer, Son of Pork Chops, Muffin Magic, Bob Callie, Talons, Alight, Cheddar Funk, Big Noober, Lyric Nim, I Killed the Beast, a name that Sally did not get translated for me, and I apologize that I'm unable to read it, Bahamut Magics, Chaos Winds, Crackle Box, Tina Hacks, and Silly Little Dino. Welcome. If I butchered anyone's name, I apologize in advance. Feel free to correct me or stay and lurk if you want because we love our lurkers. But welcome. I hope you enjoy 30 days of emotes courtesy of Forrest. Thank you so much. That is incredibly, incredibly fucking kind. Can I alter the font to Wingdings? I don't think the marathon timer will allow me to choose Wingdings. <laughs> I don't think it has wingdings. Uh, I don't see wingdings on here. I use a marathon timer that keeps track of it so I don't have to. And they do not have wingdings, unfortunately. <laughs> it did add. Thank you, Rio. I wasn't sure what the time was at before. So I, I know in the past, I think the marathon timer has like been oh um when that's happened so I, I wanted to make sure that it counted all of those appropriately thank you hi members thank you how are you doing hi roxy how are you hi is Reddle. um i mean we have a party with a black mage that's got googly eyes that seems like pretty legit <laughs> Oh, the untranslated name is Sancha123. Thank you, Akristor. Usually it translates, like, I have the, the BTTV and FFZ stuff that usually does that for me, but every once in a while it misses some. No wingding sounds like a design flaw. <laughs> I'll, I'll contact. <laughs> I'll just, you know, I'll just reach out and be like, hey, could y'all, um. Could y'all do me a favor and add wingdings? Oh, don't worry, Hummus. I have coffee. <laughs> hey. Hi, Spoonie. Hi, chat. How is everyone here? Bard wave. Tristan, thank you so much for 47 months. Welcome on in. I really appreciate it. Hi, I'm doing great. How are you today? Uh, 
let's see here. So one other thing that I need to do is mark on our subathon list that we have met our next awesome August incentive, which is pretty bonkers. <laughs> I, thanks to your support, will be doing a streamy singles playing power washing sim. Please look forward to it. <laughs> Please look forward to me eventually washing a bunch of stuff. I've heard actually the power washing sim is really fun. <laughs> Our next awesome August goal to unlock is going to be at 1300 sub points. We are currently at 1203, which means we are 97 sub points away from this. But at 1300, I will be hosting an 80s movie night, which means that I'm gonna go on Amazon Prime and take a look at what's available for watch parties. And I'm gonna find us one or two dope ass 80s movies for us to all watch along together. Uh, in case you don't have Amazon Prime, don't worry. I'm going to put a timer up on the screen when we start the movie. So if you join us right at the time, if you join us later on, and you have like Netflix or somewhere else where you can watch the movie, you can just scrub to the time and join us anyway. Uh, but that is at 1300 sub points. Also, casual reminder that at 1400 sub points, I also have BizHawk Shuffler Night number two community edition which if you missed bizhawk shuffler that was me playing like 50 different games where i played each one of them for anywhere between 30 to 60 seconds at a time and the mod team got to pick them all and it was a riot this time i'm going to let the community pick that means you you and chat you get to submit games for bizhawk shuffler and make me play them <laughs> Also, 1,500 sub points is the Justin Bailey suit incentive where I will literally go out and I will buy the green hair, hot pink suit outfit for Samus and I will cosplay as her for our playthrough of Metroid Dread. Submit! I've heard it's like weirdly super satisfying to play again or buy it, so I'm looking forward to it. Oh, also, just uh, just so you all know, if you're unfamiliar with how subathons work here, so I know a lot of places on Twitch, streamers will do one single day where they have a whole subathon and they stream for like 24 Spoonie, hours. I'm worried about your black mage. He seems to be a Popeye goldfish. <laughs> I am concerned. Don't worry, it's, it's fine. It's fine, Star. I mean, listen. <clears throat> If, if things weren't fine, shoot, I should have just kept this open. <laughs> I should have just kept this open. Listen, if, if things weren't fine with this black mage, could we do this? No, we couldn't! That's right! So it's fine. Everything's okay. We look very okay. <laughs> That's not gonna get old. <laughs> Thank you for 25 months, Star. Welcome back. How are you doing today? Oh, and I, sorry, I was gonna say, um... The way that subathons work around here is uh, I used to do things where I would play games for like, you know, 24 hours straight, but I realized that I can't really do that anymore. <laughs> As I've gotten older, I just get really tired and cranky and want to sleep. So instead of making myself stay up for like 30 hours straight and being dead for two days, I instead break up subathons over usually two or three days in a row. So we'll stream for as long as I can sit here and be happy and put on a good show. Then we end stream, I pause the timer, I go get some sleep, and we wake up the next day and start it all over. Hey Cozy Void, how are you doing? Yeah, see the problem is that these are heckin' expensive and I can't afford them. Oh 
man, but this might be poison eye. Yeah, I think, oh no, I think this one is poison eye. I'm like 99% sure that's poison eye. I think that's poison eye. All right, so we need to get some money. We need to grind out some money. Time to go collect more folders. Actually, what I should probably go do is hop on the boat because we have a chance of running into Buccaneers and they're worth like, if I remember right, 200 gold each. So I'm gonna hop on the boat and see if we can get lucky and get some Buccaneers. Also, I'm scared because Y'all, I just looked at my red mage's health and went, ah, we have 54 health. I'm starting to learn. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> We had, our red mage had 54 health, Neo. I'm starting to slowly learn what the symbols mean and hell yeah, we got some freaking buccaneers. Let's go. Oh, oh that's okay, Techie. That did seem like one that would be really complicated to get done. But, I mean, TBH, I would still, like, a thousand percent be happy to have a boat with googly eyes. Uh, okay, cool, we got first strike. I was like, I don't know which one that is. Wait, hang on. I'm gonna bop that. This is Final Fantasy and Wingdings. <laughs> I'm going to beat the whole game in Wingdings. You know why? Because I can't. Because <laughs> I can. Which is hilarious, because y'all also realize that that means that I will have beaten Final Fantasy 1 twice in one year, right? I'd also like to point out, depending on how many hours get added to the subathon, we could actually sit down and beat Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings in one weekend. Also, Tristan, you're saying you for one actually prefer uh, this style of subathon anyway? Instead of a stream, you're gonna miss a bunch of no matter what. We get two or three crazy fun long streams in a row we can mostly be here for. Yeah, I agree. I mean, that is one reason why I kept doing it that way as well. Is after the first time I did a subathon like this, I kind of pulled the community and and asked how folks felt about it. And actually, most everybody agreed that they felt it was a lot more fun to know that they didn't feel pressured to stay up really late so they wouldn't miss things. <laughs> or, you know, have to go to bed because like, sleep's important and stuff. And, but you know, they could go to bed as well and then look forward to having more fun streams the next day. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting. I'm starting to believe, Crimson. I'm starting to believe. 
I am the Neo of Wingdings. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've beaten Final Fantasy 1, 2, and 3 this year. Hey, I'm gonna beat 4 when it comes out. Spoomy is just gonna wing it, Bard Derp. I am. I am going to wing it, you're right. See, this right here is 50 health. Monk has 50 health. Now Monk has 99 health. webcam webcam uh, that was mouse mouse i think mouse mouse is 99 oh my god yeah i'm super excited for final fantasy 4 remastered i pre-ordered it in fact i just said screw it and i went ahead and i i just did the pre-order for all of them so i now own all of the pixel remasters I was like, heck it, I'm gonna buy them all anyway. I might as well get a small discount. Oh, it's, oh, it's Mouse 8? I haven't been able to figure that out yet. Black Mage has 15 health. Or maybe 25? Mm. No, I think that'd be two pieces of paper. Because I've noticed that I think that there are capitalization differences in the health numbers too. So like open folder is only a one in certain places it seems like. I don't know. I'm still kind of figuring that one out. yourself yeah it was i was like you know what i because i had bought final fantasy two uh three separately tempest and then i bought final fantasy four separately and then i was literally going to buy final fantasy one separately and i realized wait why am i doing that i could just buy all of them at this point i know i'm going to so why am i putting it off Yo, this Sahagan group is rough. <gasps> is there Demon Fang and Tiles of Arise? Good. Good. I need it in my life. Although, I'm really torn because I'm going to be playing Final Fantasy IV, so I'm like, dude, how am I supposed to have time for all these RPGs? <laughs> You bought all of them too. Nice, Freya. Also, hi, how are you doing today? So far, Monkey and Googly Eyes Mage are the only ones that have bought the farm. Easy, play FF4 during the cutscenes in Tales? <laughs> but then I won't know what's going on. I mean, how am I supposed to scream at the protagonists when they ask, uh, oh, what's wrong? Nothing. Girl, I swear, if you say nothing is wrong one more time, I'm gonna lose my shit. Freaking Colette, stop it. There is something wrong. 
wrong, you're lying to me. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go stay at the end because we're out of meepity meeps. Also, I think the pencil is an exclamation point. I figured that out too. How much money do I have? Ooh, I... I don't know if that's a, over 2,500 or not. I think it's 2,000 something. Can we afford poison, huh? <gasps> I can. Yes. Okay, our white mage has poison now. That's good. All right, so the other thing that I, I want to do, though, um, I want to get probably at least 2,000 so that I can buy Cura for my red mage and white mage. Because that's a thousand each. Okay. I think I'm okay with just Ollie the White Mage knowing how to cast Poison for now because we did also buy like 15 antidotes. No, stop running away, whoopies! Dun, 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 dun. This would be a nightmare if it was randomized. Don't give a Chris story any ideas, Howie. <laughs> Hi, how are you doing today? Once there is a randomizer, you have plans? <laughs> it sounds hella fun, but dear God, why? Why not? That's the real question, why not? Super fun battle. Man, I would totally play a. I don't know if I would play a randomized version with Wingdings, but I would definitely play a randomized version of Final Fantasy Pixel Remasters. Am I single? I'm a single individual. There's no additional spoonies. Am I in a relationship? Yes. I'm very happily married. Bloop. Yay! We're dodging all the things! But we don't talk about unpaid interns to me, though. Oh yeah, I would love to see Randomizer come out for this quick. Granted, you know, I'm not the one that has to do any hard work for it. <laughs> I just, yeah, I would just get to play it. So as long as it takes them, I will wait, but I will totally play a randomized version of any of the Pixel Remasters. Oh, really all the voices in my head make me a plural? I guess so. Actually, there is a Forky Neo. That's my evil twin. I'm an NFT. <laughs> I mean, considering that I'm monogamous, I guess technically you could consider me an NFT. Because Angry Trees is the only one allowed to hold me. How are 
you doing? How do we know Forky's the evil twin? She doesn't even have the evil goatee. Well, Forky did wear an evil mustache for the Fable playthroughs. Does that count? Ollie says it does. Ooh, nice, we got Buccaneers, good. Money, money, money! That's right, Ollie. Ah! I'm Jelly, I'm good, how are you doing today? Oh, no, that's fine, Neo. I mean, listen, if everyone was required to know literally everything in the universe, that's super overwhelming. Doesn't seem possible. Seems fake. <laughs> NFTs are basically uh, pieces of art, images, stuff like that hey. that are Hello, non friends. tradable. I hope all is well. You're all beautiful inside and out. Orma, I think, probably had. Yeah, Orma and Hummus honestly had a much better explanation of it than I did. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's pretty popular in the crypto space these days. Cassie, thank you so much for 17 months. Welcome back. Hi, how are you doing? Oh, awesome. Thank you, Shy. You've been told that Forky has the conical twin tails that Chibi Moon gets when she becomes Black Lady. Yes. Hi, Kendrick. How are you doing? I have enough MP to try for one more set. Oh no, I don't. I actually don't have MP to AoE them down. Yeah, it's kind of like owning a, a digital version of an original. So, like, imagine if Thomas Kincaid actually didn't have, like, thousands and thousands and thousands of, like, printers printing all of his artwork on posters and calendars and stuff. Imagine it was just one painting and only one person could own it forever. It's like that. Also, I just realized I haven't even been to the elf castle to talk to the prince. I'm curious, hey chat, do you actually have to talk to the prince before you go to the, the, the marsh cave? Or can you go to the marsh cave first? Hi Rad the Karma, how are you doing? And you're doing great, great. I'm glad to hear that, Kendrick. You do have to talk to him? Well, it's a good thing I came back then. Let's see, I have a thousand something money right now. Yeah, I believe you can trade NFTs. Like you could resell that NFT to another person. You just can't duplicate it. And I believe that the original creator of the NFT gets a percentage for every time that it's traded to another person. Which is the main reason why NFTs are starting to get popular is that it is very, very common in the art world for the original artist of something to sell a work of art for not really that much money and then a gallery will turn around and sell it for like a ridiculous ass ton of money and the original creator of that artwork won't get any of that money for the dozens and dozens of other times it gets traded around by people. And it's shitty because uh, the artists work really hard on that piece of art and deserves a cut of it so that they can continue to feed themselves and have a roof over their head and make art. So I can at least get behind that particular part of the idea of it. Although, to be honest, I don't know nearly enough about NFTs to really have that much of an opinion. What's the white mage trying to be? The white mage is Ollie Murdoch. 
It's my bird buddy. about what things are. You know, pinning a course that it's not like something that goes against our chat rules or something. But like, there's literally nothing wrong with not knowing something. I would much rather feel welcome to ask questions about things I don't know than feel pressured to know everything, even though that is literally fucking impossible. <laughs> says come on yeah I definitely know that there's environmental issues that come up with Bitcoin and I have heard that that also occurs with NFTs I just literally don't know anything about it so that's why I'm like I can't I can't really say that I have an opinion formed because I am not nearly informed enough on the subject to have one which by the way is also totally fine Totally fine if you feel like you don't know enough about something to formulate an opinion yet. Yeah, it is, Ollie. What you saying no to? You were saying come on like 30 times earlier. Oh, meanwhile, Ollie's just over there practicing. You want to buy the googly eyed black mage NFT? <laughs> Well, Techie made that sprite, so. <laughs> Funny enough, I actually do think a Christopher mentioned that he and Techie were going to release the sprites. So if anybody else wanted to play through Final Fantasy 1 with the Bard sprites, he could. having a hard time finding any buccaneers now. That sounds like any time I say AC as the shorthand for Animal Crossing Neo, people are like, do you mean Astral Chain? Animal Crossing? Assassin's Creed? Armored Core? How are you doing? Air conditioning? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. I actually have a lot more money than I thought now, but that's fine. We'll just keep farming money because then I can also buy some black magic spells. Yeah, surely I'm in Advent Children or Asheron's Call. Ace Combat? Wow, I haven't heard of that in a long time. I would prefer that we wait until I see the class change. Just to make sure nobody gets like too excited and then maybe accidentally spoils what they look like. I think I think that once I see the class change, that would probably be a good time. Okay, let's go take a nap. I'm going to buy Cura for my red mage and my white mage. I'm gonna see if I can figure out what some of those other black magic spells are. And then we're gonna talk to the prince. And I think then we'll go into Marsh Cave. Artwork chocolate. I 
I still have 2,000 and something, I think. Yeah, Ollie does know how to meow. <laughs> uh, she doesn't show up on stream super often, but Angry Trees and I have a Russian Blue Mix cat named Luna. And Ollie definitely learned how to meow like her. <laughs> Okay, so... This has an A at the end of it. Is that an I? Is that F Fira? I think that's Fira. Fira. Cool. Yeah, then I'm gonna buy Fyra for both of those characters. How much money do I have left? Not a lot. Does Luna get me out at by Ollie? Yes. <laughs> Actually, yes. <laughs> um, also, what's really cute is sometimes, because um, when Luna meows at us, we'll ask her, what is it? Sometimes Ollie will meow, and then he'll say, what is it? Oh, you're so cute. Uh, uh, yes, Prince sick asleep stuff uh yep things i think that hey chat i think that was all i needed to do right is, is talk to the person who is next to the prince and they're like oh no our prince is sick and endangered help us i just want to make sure since i literally can't read any of the dialogue <laughs> Oh, do I not need to talk to him at all until I kill Astos? Oh well, well, now I have just in case. Uh, we won't be able to kill Astos for a while anyway. We gotta go to the Marsh Cave first. Oh my god, you're right, Akristor! This is like when I was a little kid and I had to ask my older brother what certain words meant when I was playing Final Fantasy VI. I'm out of me! I can't heal myself! I'm out of me! Why didn't you buy any potions? I don't know what they do! What's a potion? cure the green bubbles. <laughs> Why does it make a crunch sound when I walk? Well, how old are we talking, Yami? Like, did you know what a potion was when you were like five? <laughs> be able to read the word and understand it without using the item. cave now. Oh, also Astoast is the dark elf. I call him Astoast because that's his name. Oh, I see. You read the manual. 
Yami up in here cheating, reading the manual. <laughs> Although, when I was a kid and I couldn't get very far in Final Fantasy VI, I did used to read the game guide at night. I don't recall if I can actually get any of the treasure here yet. My, you know, my brother got me into playing Final Fantasy games and video games in general. My brother also used to read Dragonlance to me when I was a kid. Until he got sick of reading it to me and then made me read it myself. Oh yeah, these are the guys that you have to cast magic on. My favorite is... is is still Tasselhoff. I'm a sucker for Tasselhoff. He's heading really hard. Uh, the chest? Maybe? The chest, I'm assuming, contained, and then I don't know what it contained. <laughs> the chest contained something. Uh, some kind of potion. I don't know what it does. The chest contained an item. Heck, that did not deal enough damage. Oh good, okay, it did get them really close to death though, so neat, I'm just gonna punch them. I really did, Quark, I mean, yeah, my brother and sister both have always been really awesome. I don't know what the chest contained. A sword! It contained a sword, a sword. Ooh, a better sword than what I had. any more treasure that I want to grab. No! Not these freaking
freaking spiders get out! Oof, at least we got first strike. From the- oh, from the stories I've told you guys, you're genuinely jealous of my relationship with my siblings. You were always the black sheep because you loved RPGs and fantasy. Though it did help you bond with your grandma, or your grandpa. Oh, he was your enabler, nice! <laughs> yeah, yeah, my brother and my sister both, they, they made me a lot of who I am. And my aunt and my mom too, because she was really into computers. I mean, really, my dad, I guess, is the black sheep in our family. <laughs> um, my dad's really the only one of us that's not into like video games and computers and stuff, but he still like cheers us on from the side. <laughs> he's like, I don't understand any of that, but uh, you know, he still like watches my stream and stuff and asks my mom how I'm doing. It's really cute. I love my dad. These are some angry looking doggos. Hi Steve! Hi Zach, how are y'all doing? Yeah, that's always my favorite. Like that's that's what I strive to be, Steve, is if I don't understand something that somebody is excited for, I strive to be like, I have no idea what that is, but I am super duper excited and happy that you were excited about it. <laughs> That's the dream. Like everything here poisons. I got uh something. Don't know what it is, but I got it. Doggos. Hey, Paul's place. How are you doing? I mean, granted, at least I knew what I was getting into with Marsh Cave this time. The first time I played this game, it was not good. <laughs> Save, which is really nice. I got. I think that's a cottage. Poison. Okay. Well, we 
we're killing the slimes. And I'm trying to use my antidotes. <laughs> Sorry, Howie. <laughs> I know that the saves always throw people off. Because uh, I believe all of the pixel remasters, the save sound is the same as the FF4 getting a whisper sound. Um, also, complex suplex, I, I'm gonna say this in the, the nicest way possible. Um, because you probably don't actually mean anything bad, but it is super duper something that makes me feel uncomfortable to have someone say to me that they're stealing me from my partner. That's super weird. <laughs> I am a human being with thoughts and it was made choices in her life and I'm happy. Why on earth would you say that? You could just say that you think I'm super cool or something. I just don't know why you would say that to someone. No, you can't steal angry trees. Also, I mean, he's a tree, so his roots are pretty set here. I, I think you'd have a hard time pulling him out of the ground. <laughs> All right, it's Pisco Demon time. We missed. Oh god, we're getting smacked to hell. It's fine, we win. <laughs> I got something. <laughs> I got something. Yeah. That's right, you check out that something that I got from that chest that I definitely know what it is. Poor monkey. Monkey's died so many times. But hey, we beat the Pisco Demon's first try instead of getting raffle stomped. I mean, one of our characters got raffle stomped, but it could have been a lot worse. Have a good night, Kendrick. Thank you for joining us. The idea of Angry Trees being a tree with very set roots who travels around in an RV is just a bit ironic. <laughs> it is. It's a good joke. I run. I'm just gonna try to collect the other loot, maybe? walking around on four big roots instead of tires. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, can we be Howl's moving RV? That sounds so cool! I want that. that I pick that. I pick Howl's moving RV. <gasps> and! Yo, it would totally make sense, Orma, because angry trees could be Howl. And I could be, uh, 
what's your name? Because uh, she gets turned really old and I'm like 9,007. <laughs> that counts, right? Now you're remembering the picture of an RV with legs just labeled Bubba Yak. <laughs> uh oh, I think that's a back attack. Yep. Who would be Calcifer, Ollie or Luna? I don't know. Probably Ollie. She is the one who runs this whole thing. She runs this place. I'm gonna give uh, poor dead monkey some new armor. So she can think about that while she's on the floor. as quickly as possible and I know that there's technically more loot here but a decent chunk of it you can't access without the elf key and we don't have that yet so I might as well just come back I might as well just come back if I need to you know are getting scary when I know that that says preemptive strike. You got to go out and walk your doggos again today? Oh man, that's awesome, Forrest! Hell yeah, I'm so glad you get a chance to do that again. That's right, I got all the chests here, I'm pretty sure. There's a part of you that wants to find time to see how much effort it would take to do all the sprites for one Final Fantasy IV pixel remaster character. Well, I think I know which one that would be. <laughs> I am becoming one with the wing dings, Light Bane, it's true. be getting some XP right now, but Monkey's died like three times, and I really don't want her to get further behind the rest of the party, if I can help it, especially since she missed out on the Pisco Demon XP. <laughs> Your mental image. She wakes up at the church later, looks at herself, and is like, what the hell happened to my armor, and what's this bracelet doing on my wrist? <laughs> Cannon now. Preemptive, run away. All right, so we're 
we're gonna go all the way back around to the elf town. Uh, I'm gonna have to try to figure out what key item it is we got because I don't remember. No one answered that. It'll be funnier for me to figure it out. Hi, Toppy. How are you doing today? Oh my god, the Hildebrand quests are great. I still need to finish those. jamming out to the battle music. It's so good. I'm so sad when it's running away. You're tired, want cookie? You should totally get yourself a delicious cookie. That sounds great. Also a very good point, Techie. Like Goku, Monkey will probably die a lot, but will be one of the most powerful characters in the end. Partially because we have temper. <laughs> Let's see... Money-wise... We got 4,000-something. Is that P good? That means I can experiment with purchasing some more things. Also take a nice nap. Starts with a C? Canoe? dozen cookies and two peas cookies oh man that all sounds great that sounds freaking wonderful i'm trying to figure out what this is <laughs> uh, it has an a in it i know that much other spells or I could buy one at 2500 gill spell I'm gonna actually take a look at the black magic spells that are 2500 This is Wing Ding's Final Fantasy, Toffee. Wing Ding's Final Fantasy. Also, the Black Mage has googly eyes, so it's googly edition, too.
I think this is Blizzara. I don't remember what the teardrop was, though. But I think that's maybe Blizzara? Hang on, I'm gonna go check our spell list. Yeah, that's gotta be Blizzara. Ollie. Hi. What you doing? Are you trying to eat my Luigi poster again? Not very nice. Yeah. Yeah, I caught you. I caught you! <laughs> yeah, all the symbols represent a letter in the English language, although capital and lowercase letters are also different. Also, all the numbers are also wingdings. So... Yeah, I think I'm gonna buy Blizzara? Because I at least know for sure that's what that is. Ollie, <laughs> I see you! Yes, and also punctuation. I do know that a pencil is an exclamation point. I do not believe that we have the herb yet. I'm pretty sure that that comes from ass toast. So that means preemptive strike. It is kind of like learning a new language. A useless language, but a fun one. <laughs> I personally am having a great time with it. And I'm glad to hear you do agree, by the way, Dave. That's wonderful to hear. I am, I'm having a great time with this. It's really silly and perfect. This is perfect for me. <laughs> Town now. <gasps> Techie mean vehicles? Okay. Let me look. Also, I'm running away from any non buccaneer fight. Throwing things on things counts. <laughs> that counts. Let me let me take a look. Okay, okay, there's the three separate files. Dope. Thank you, Equestor. Should I, should I like do that and restart the game? Do you think it would be worth it to do that and restart the game or should we save that as a special surprise for tomorrow? everything here. I want to say I bought everything I wanted. Maybe it didn't. Oh, this is Invis! Yeah, that's Invis.
tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow I feel like might likely be evolution day. Oh, so not not like restarting the whole game, hummus. I I just mean like saving and quitting, and then like rebooting the game up because Techie Techie made us some sprites for the vehicles. So I was considering whether to move those files over now or save them for tomorrow. I mean, I feel like I'm in a decent spot to do that right now. game. We love our lurkers too. You're always welcome to lurk. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, we did park our vehicle right outside. It's true. So let me make a save. Okay, and it's going to be the top save. So this will take me a sec. Oh god. Uh Okay, it was like, hi, let's see if I can remember how to close the game. <laughs> oh man, imagine if this was the first time that I was playing any of the Pixel Remasters, because no joke, when I played Final Fantasy um three i could not for the life of me figure out how to close the game for like 10 minutes <laughs> i couldn't figure it out for like 10 minutes okay um i'm gonna play this for a second well let's see can we get any final fantasy songs No, I guess probably not. Yeah, whatever. That's that's an RPG. That works. Okay, I have the files. Okay, so let me open some things and move some stuff around. Actually, really fast. That was faster than I thought. Okay, I have no clue what on earth uh, Techie and Chris were added, but I'm pretty sure it's vehicles, and I don't know, there were a couple of other files Chris were said were for fun. outside town real quick. I 
think it's kind of perfect though at Chris Store that he comes out pixelated. That's literally perfect because it matches the rest of the background. Yo, Bob's just frolicking back there. Cheering us on. <laughs> Yo, I am having the time of my fucking life right now. <laughs> Thank you, Acrystor. Thank you, Techie. Grasslands now has Bob. What happens when you park the ship sideways? I will try that out. I will try that out next. Just remind me if I forget. Hi, Shockwave. How are you doing today? I just can't believe Bob's in my game of Final Fantasy. Hang it. I'm gonna just fight him. to my RPG! Oh my god, I don't remember where I'm supposed to go now! Way to go, but she's not telling. That's what happens when we park the boat sideways. <laughs> it's beautiful. Nah, they got rid of the Peninsula of Power. I believe it was never intended to exist in the first place. However, if you are so determined to have the Peninsula of Power in your version of the game, they have made mods for it. Folks have modded the back end. Yee, squares on 
grass paper. That's just every time I look in the bottom right corner and there's Bob, I can't even believe it. <laughs> Dragon Warrior. Matoyo, do I have the thing that you needed? I don't know. I don't. Mailbox, mailbox, mailbox. Circle up symbol, symbol, of symbol, symbol. <laughs> yep, the brooms know everything. They do. Hi, Bear Steak. Thank you. How are you doing? You know what, I'm just gonna ask because I don't remember and the game is going to be zero help to me considering it's all in Wing Jinx. Hey chat, where the heckity hex do you go after you finish Marsh Cave? I do not remember. Yeah, why would the Black Mage not have googly eyes? Then. But first, I have to get my googly eyed boat back. No, 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 no. Thank you. Yeah, Belle might have already gone to bed and missed the googly-eyed boats. I'm actually gonna step into the inn real quick. play this game with wingdings that's okay indigo i'm playing it for you in wingdings <laughs> so you don't have to <laughs> don't you know hummus that that's what happens when you let the black mage drive the boat Yep. I mean, 
and the Black Mage has always had googly eyes. You just couldn't see them till now. That's why it's a remaster? It's enhanced. Enhanced. Hey, Shimada. What's up with the text? It's Wingdings. That's all. I'm playing the game in Wingdings. Also, you know what? I'm just gonna look at the friggin' map. Oh my god, that'll be so nice not to have to type in a code to look at the map. Except for I can't read what any of the places are, so <laughs> it's not really that helpful. <laughs> yeah, I just need to go down south. I just need to go south. Hi, Kaj. Thanks for bringing folks over. How are you doing today? Hi, I'm Spoonie. I'm playing Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings. And, um... It is something. <laughs> Welcome to chaos. Also, all of the sprites were custom made by one of our community members. So, we've got those too. Hi, Solaria. Hi, Voltares. Hey, Shotgun Kelly. Welcome. How are you doing? If by some chance we run out of time tonight, do we get another chance tomorrow to keep it going? Or do I take the weekend off? You know, I actually don't know if I've ever had that happen, Ash. Um, typically, in the past, if we get super close to the end of time, then I've either ended to leave a couple of hours on, or if we've gotten a lot of time added onto the subathon in general, then I might add an extra hour or so, like wound it up to three hours at the beginning of each day. Uh, stream tonight I'm planning on ending probably around 1 a.m. So we should still have about three hours left on the clock starting tomorrow. My plan is for Saturday and Sunday to start a little bit early and go late. I decided against starting Friday early because I know that a, a lot of folks tend to work on Friday anyway. So if I start early, then there might be folks that miss the beginning of stream anyway. So I figure early stream better for Saturdays and Sundays. Also, because I wanted to make sure that all of the leaving stuff works. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no problem, Ash. That was a good question. Thank you for asking. Our, yeah, our guests are Bodie McBoatface. Oh, by the way, I'd like to point out to anyone who has more recently joined us that um, all the character sprites are customized. We haven't evolved our characters yet, so uh, they're going to get new sprites when they become the upgraded versions of each of their classes, and I have no idea what that will look like. <laughs> But I am so excited to find out. Okay, so we are gonna go fight Astoast. Because we need stuff. We have this nice fancy crown. And we're gonna go give it to Astos, who's totally not going to turn into the Dark Elf and paralyze us and betray us. Which sounds hilariously familiar to something in Final Fantasy IV. Sure. <laughs> Hi, Rune. Oh no, don't worry. There's 
There's no need to adjust your television set. We're playing Final Fantasy 1 and Wingdings. Hi. How's it going? Penguins going to you heal, and we're gonna save, and then enter the castle. Yeah, then we should be able to get a bunch of sweet loot. Yo, this freaking castle music, though. This is nice. Ho 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 ho! <laughs> Bomb diamond, smaller diamond, cancer symbol waves, cancer symbol waves, cancer symbol. Eh, pencil! <laughs> I don't know what you're saying to me, ass toast! That sure is something. Oh good, his sprite's just as wonderful. This is fine. Well, at least we were able to hit him hard. <laughs> Victorious Black Mage. <laughs> I got the key item. Uh, for Chris uh, something. <laughs> Justinian, welcome to Wingdings Final Fantasy. All right, I'm pretty sure I can just go back to the Elf Prince now, which is good considering two of my poor party members are freaking dead. Stupid ass toast. Hi, Geo Spells. Welcome to an epic adventure of wild proportions and Wingdings. be fun to play all of Final Fantasy 1 unable to read or decipher any of the text. Although hilariously, I have slowly but surely been picking up some of the letters. We've got our emotional support corpses. By the way, I would like to point out that it is really adorable that Ollie's death sprite also has feathers coming out of the robe. Hi. 
All right, time to go revive ourselves. Final fantasy. Yay, not dead. Have a good night, Justy Game. Thanks for joining us. How much money do I have? Um, like 24,000 something? I don't even know how much this in charges. gold. Alright, well, luckily, we are now fully healed up again. So I'm gonna save, and we're gonna go talk to the prince and get a cool key. And then we can go collect a bunch of loot. Maybe. I think. I don't know. Maybe not. Shoot! I don't remember. I thought we could go there now. Hmm. I think it's Matoya that has the herb. open this door at least. Nope. Wait, so what freaking key item did I get? I have no idea what that says. Also, the googly eyes are new. I see, so too. I'm good. How are you doing? No, oh no, not randomizer, just straight up, like, all of the font is wing being shade malik. <laughs> and, um, Tekitomi made 260 custom sprites for the different classes and characters, so we have a Spoonie customized party, it's really dope. <laughs> uh, hey Chad, I don't remember what the key item is that Astos gave us and I can't read this. Uh, it starts with a C! <laughs> oh, right! That is the thing! Oh, right! He stole the crystal eye from Matoya, so now we bring this to Matoya, and then she gives us the herb, and then we get to come back and give the herb to the prince, and then we get the key! This is all coming back to me. Egg! That googly-eyed black mage, though, lol. With Dragon School, did you see the bow? <laughs> did you see our jiggly googly eyed bow? Thank you for 51 months. Welcome back. Oh, the white mage is actually Ollie Justinian. every time I look at it. <laughs>
Listen, I'm just saying, if we didn't already have Bard now, I would definitely consider making the Black Mage with googly eyes. Bard, help me. <laughs> I think he's going to love it, Techie. All right, I got your eyeball. So you gave me happy face. <laughs> happy face, square, circle, diamond. Snowflake, square, other square. Symbol I don't know what it is. Symbol that I don't know what it is. Probably owe a valid drink. <laughs> uh, yeah, I definitely, definitely owe him a drink by now. Oh, the last two symbols were Pisces and Virgo. Thank you, Thought. Okay, so. personification of bard mode. <laughs> no, the developers did not intend for the game to be this complicated. I I think that we can pretty much guarantee that they did not intend for it to be this complicated. I probably have things under control. <laughs> the googly-eyed chip rune? It's art. Freaking art. can defeat the Lich. Yeah, I got that there magic herby thing. We now have an elven key. Elven key. A 
Have a good night, Granny Share. Thank you for joining us. You rest well. Cool stuff that I can't read. Slightly better hammer. What else did I get? Um. Oh no! There's some gloves, but I actually don't think that I can wear gloves. Oh no! I think those are fighter only. I I literally don't think that I can wear any of that at all. Well, Venda Trash. <laughs> It'll be Vendor Trash. Oh yeah, that is 100% the true lore of Final Fantasy thought, I agree. pick up gear so actually all right heck that we should go ahead and grab the stuff that's here i should go ahead and get the stuff that is available to us on this particular piece of land you may or may not have delved into a rabbit hole of trying to <laughs> decipher wingdings yeah i think i'm right there with you roga i think we're all trying to decipher wingdings Please don't kill monkey. Please? I am literally begging you to please stop trying to kill monkey. I need her to live. She needs XP. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stay at the end real quick. Save and I'm gonna go to. I guess I'll go to Decay first. Ugh, no, I don't wanna do that. I'll go back to Astos' castle first. <laughs> I will go back to the castle first. And then we'll go back to the Mist Cave, even though I don't really want to, but if I remember right, there is actually some decent loot in the treasure there, so. And you're doing okay, Sham? Just woke up a little confused. Your body decided napping was a good idea at like midnight. Oh no. I mean, it, I, I say this all the time to folks who end up falling asleep at unusual times for them, but that probably means that you needed the rest and I'm glad you got it. And I hope it doesn't mess up your sleep schedule too much. Yes, Roga, you are correct. Our names are Spoonie, Can't Read, Wingdings. <laughs> Nails it. I also just realized that I don't think I did your name singer yet today, Roga. Roga Dertikon. Hi, I hope you're doing well today. Excuse me, Mr. Bat, thank you. Yeah! Booty loves cheese! I do love cheese. Cheese is delicious! 
Neptune, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. Welcome on in to Helldark, Carrie Fiend, Elfrey, Sedentary Salad, and Quad Edits. I hope y'all enjoy 30 days of emotes courtesy of Shan the Duck. Take these before you come to your senses and am no longer dazed and confused. I would not be surprised if you stayed dazed and confused in a stream considering we're playing Final Fantasy and Wing Dings. <laughs> Thank you, Sham. I really appreciate that. Dude, I love naps. I love naps. Naps are so good. It is also very, very fun having people show up and have absolutely no idea what's going on. I also completely forgot that these are trap chests. But it's fine, because we have Diaga. And I'm just gonna destroy everything. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Aw, oh, for his redeeming name singer for a night. Stray or crash forest. Thank you for using the crystals. I got a sword. But it is a useful sword. It's a sword that's not as good as the one that I already have. Hey, it's mommy. I'm a Diaga them too. But it do. Rat it down. Rat it down. Rat it down. Rat it Him. Ooh, a level up. And I got a staff. Oops. Uh... Yay. Slightly better bonk staff. Actually, ooh, that might be one of the usable staffs, if I remember right. Thank you, Gorg. You rest well. Have a wonderful night. Silver Moon 9000. Thank you for using your crystal streaking name singer for a night. Ah! Real monsters! Uh, also, that, okay, that's less good. They got to attack us first. All right, we're going for big old AoEs. Big heckin' AoEs. I said big, big heckin' AoEs. Hey, we leveled. And I got something. I got a punchy glove. A different punchy glove. Um... that I also don't seem to be able to equip unless it is the same glove that I'm already wearing. Which is possible, but I don't think it is. It's not the same glove, but I can't equip it. But, wait. That might be the, um, oh man, that might be the, the lightning gauntlets though. Which that would be good, because then I can use those to cast Thundaga, or Thundara. I forget which one exactly. Although quite a bit less useful than it was in my White Mage playthrough. Yeah, I have absolutely no idea how I would use items and wingdings anyway. <laughs> how you 
Holy welcome! How are you doing today? It did, yeah. Those items helped out a ton for my white mage run. Oh, wait, shoot. That's right. I gotta go this way. Have a good night, Sham. I hope you're gonna get your sleep schedule back on track. And I, I hope the nap was at least, like, a good one, you know? You have a wonderful night. Thank you for stopping by. It's good to see you. I'm gonna sleepy heal you. And, you know, I think I've got three tents. I'm thinking I might use one before we go into Marsh Cave, just for a little extra safety so we have full MP charges. to playing a party of four white mages, Yami, is having to spend like six hours grinding so that you can roll luck on the Pisco demons over and over again until you hope that you only get two or three and don't get absolutely obliterated. Because they hit like trucks. <laughs> Like, honestly, the Pisco Demons and then fighting Carrie. Those were the toughest moments in the White Mage playthrough. Let's see, I didn't go up this way at all. So I'm gonna start off by going up this way. I do feel like four white mages with googly eyes would be very unstoppable. By the way, also thank you all for hanging out today for day one of the Awesome August Subathon. I'm having a really good time with this. I hope that you all are too. We've currently got a little under five hours left on the clock. There's still uh, quite a few hours that we can add on for the rest of this weekend streams. And our next awesome August goal, I believe, is 80s movie night. And Dia is so nice. I got a dagger. I think if I go down 
this way, there's another room. What do you mean, Hylian? That's what the Black Mage's eyes always look like. Yo, that silver hammer does not mess around. Yeah, he saw everything. Picking spooters. Uh, I can't tell what I'm picking up anymore. <laughs> I, I don't know. Stuff. There was stuff in them there boxes. make a guess or try to decipher it. It's fine. It's a win fine. So far, I honestly don't feel like I've been doing too bad playing this game in Wingdings. beating Final Fantasy 1 if I can finish it. <laughs> Alright, so next stop, we're gonna go down where we originally went with the Pisco Demons, and I think there's at least one room down there that we need the elf key to open. Oh, you call my paladin run and fling the towels? Oh, thank you! I'm glad you enjoyed it! I had such a great time with that run. I actually, <laughs> I admittedly, I just went back earlier today and I was uh, reading along with some of the chat and uh, there were a lot of people saying that they enjoyed the run, so I was very, very happy to see that. <laughs> Let's see here. Probably throw you a heal, you a heal, and oh boy. I might have some Diagas left. That's probably okay. I don't really want to waste a tent if I can help it. I have no idea how much money I have. I think that's like 11,000 gil or something. The actual lore was very interesting. Thank you. You know, it's just, it's secrets that are passed down in all the Final Fantasy IV speedrunning community, and I just really felt like it was something worth sharing with you guys. <laughs> level we're at. I, I don't know. I 
don't even know where our level is. <laughs> I don't even know where the level would be listed. <laughs> oh well. It's fine. I think it's the one floor below this that has those chests. What do y'all think? Do you think we can make it to the Earth Crystal tonight? Or is that a little too ambitious? <laughs> to the front of it. Get to the Earth Cave entrance. That'd be pretty sweet. Oh no, we're not fighting four scorpions. Hey, Super Booper, how are you doing today? That's true, we do still have the vampire left. That's a good point. I think the, yeah, these are the end notes. <laughs> Happy six years. Sis, thank you for 39 months. Welcome back. Hi. Hi, Sack Attack and Raiders. How are y'all doing today? Welcome. Hi, I'm Spoonie. And I'm playing the Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remaster in Wingdings with custom Spoonie Bard sprites. <laughs> oh, yeah, but don't worry. I already killed the Pisco Demons. Uh, we're coming back with the elf key to pick up any treasure that we couldn't unlock before. <laughs> so don't worry. Don't worry. We're fine. We're totally fine. Uh, I, oh, I don't remember this. Maybe, we're, maybe we won't be fine. I don't know. Um... You know what? I'm going to make a quick save. Hello, who are you? Oh, right, more Pisco Demons, great. I love those. Oh shoot, yeah, I forgot that you can't hit them with Dia at all. Part of the reason I had so much trouble here when I played this game with all white mages. Luckily though, we have black magic, so we're okay. And I'm gonna make another quick save. Oh yeah, cause now we gotta 
fight snakes. Hi, you're a fine will. It is. It's a great fun. <laughs> Hi, Saber Goomba. Hi, King Panzen. Hi, buddy bro. How are all of you doing today? Yeah, we got the drip. We got the wing dings. We got it all. We found something. I don't know what it is. Uh, some kind of ring thingy. Oh, uh, better armor for our monk buddy. It's pretty solid. Well, I'm gonna say that was a successful series of fights. Have a good night, Super Snack Bros. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, I think it was an armlet. I don't know what kind. I can't read. <laughs> but don't worry, not being able to read won't stop me, so it's good. It's totally fine. How can I even play in Wingdings? Uh, with a lot of determination, Crystal. <laughs> Pisco demons! Oh wait, no, I can't run away from the Pisco demons. Uh, but we can do this. Punch him! Please do not hit my white mage. Whew! I hope that was worth it. Uh, what did I get? I don't even know what I got for that. <laughs> I literally don't even know. anything that's useful to me. And I'm gonna just keep quick saving because of all the heckin' Pisco demons. Yeah, 90 is pretty rough. <laughs> Nothing, so I'm definitely not stepping on those. Zebra, thank you so much for the free long resub. Welcome back. I appreciate that. This is Final Fantasy 1's Pixel Remaster in Wingdings, also with custom sprites. <laughs> But if it's an item that's stacked with other items, then I don't know what it was. Like, it could have been a tent or a cottage or something.
Yeah, the open folder means one. <laughs> Punch him good, monkey. That's what I'm calling the monk, by the way. Oh no! Oh my god! You jerks! Freaking! Ow! 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 My all of me. Pisco demons, man. They're the friggin' worst. Stop it! Stop it! Stop killing me! Alright, what did I get? Uh. I don't know! Hair and gloves? <laughs> I can't tell what I got! I think I got some kind of pair of gloves. Maybe. Or maybe another staff? I don't know. Dude, poor... Poor wingdings just got hacked. Oh, also for anyone curious what I named our characters, they are called Spoony Can't Read Wingdings. So Wingdings is our black mage and he just got wrecked. That's very true yet awesome. I do imagine by the end of this playthrough, I will be able to read Wingdings about as well as I can read all that. <laughs> Does translating wingdings count as spoilers? <laughs> well, I mean, like, don't tell me what something is, unless I've asked. Like, if I ask, then that's totally cool. But otherwise, I think it's honestly way funnier, Hummus, that I'm trying to figure these out on the fly. <laughs> this is way funnier. What'd I get? I don't know. Some kind of item. I think that might be everything that was in Marsh Cave, though. So I think that I'm good to probably leave. Which is good, because this place is awful. <laughs> this place is awful, and I want out of here. I want to go pick up my free loot at the Starter Castle, which I almost called Baron Castle. But no, no, Spoonie, that's Final Fantasy IV. We shall leave this place and we shall never speak of it again until the next time we play Final Fantasy 1. <laughs> extra tiles. I don't know how to pronounce that either, Chris, or I'm sorry. Insane man's wanted to Hi, Insane Man! You like wingdings, right? I believe you were a fan of Wingdings, if I'm not mistaken. Bloop, 
Alright, let's go up. -y. You know what is kind of terrifying too? The first time I played Final Fantasy 1, I, I spent many, many hours being completely lost in the Marsh Cave. Now that I am on my third playthrough of the game, I'm starting to know where to go, and I am very disturbed by this fact. My first playthrough, um, I did an all-white mage run, Julie, so this place was effing horrible. <laughs> the poison wasn't too bad since I could buy poison so many times, but I had to defeat the Pisco Demons with regular hammers. Basically, I just had to like keep re-rolling and hoping that I got as few Pisco Demons as possible. Yeah, the, uh, I, I don't even think that I, I don't know if I ever want to play the original just because, oh my god, like, Marsh Cave is already terrible. I feel like it would be so much worse in the original. I'm mostly scared, Gata, because usually my memory is absolute trash. <laughs> so I don't know how my brain's like, oh yeah, you go this direction. And Marsh came and like, with uh, who are you, what? How did you remember that, but also not remember what key items you get and what order you need to go to different places? Ooh, Ice Cave can be really rough, too. We'll see how we fare. Alright, let's get our lovely Black Mage friend back up. And then we're gonna stay at the end. And also, we should be able to afford to buy quite a bit of magic. If I can figure out what that magic is that we're buying. <laughs> for black magic here. I don't know what this means. And this starts with an F. I just also don't know what it means. It's some kind of Aga, but... It can't be Furaga because it's a different symbol? <laughs> I don't know how that could, could be Furaga because it doesn't make sense. It's F something something Ara. I guess I could just buy it and find out. <laughs> hey, Sonic Coonstar. Hey, Apex. How are y'all doing? That is Wingdings. You're right. We're playing Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings with a custom sprite pack. Uh, Alright, White Mage has one spell slot. Let's open. Oh, 
don't know what this is, but I'm buying it. And then we should have enough money to buy some of the higher level spells too. And I should restock up on potions. Sure, why not? I don't know how many potions I bought, but it's probably a lot. Wait a couple more tents so that we have. What is that, like four? Let's just round that up to five. Oh my god, what's a th okay, what's a three letter spell that white mage gets other than Dia that's white mage exclusive? I don't know. I, I, I don't, I don't know any of this. <sighs> yeah, I don't know what this e is, e is either, because it's F blank A blank. That's not ringing a bell for me. Oh, this is Final Fantasy 1, but in Wingdings. Also, as Daz, to be fair, I would like to point out that if you find yourself constantly wondering why you follow channels of people who are really weird, that that probably means that you're also weird, and that's okay. Vox? I don't remember what- what does Vox do? Hey chat, what does Vox do? I don't remember that spell. I don't know if I ever used it. Cure is mute. Oh. So you mean it's a spell that- uh, that seems not very useful. <laughs> Explains why I don't remember what it does. Uh, I don't know what this is, but I'm going to buy it, I guess. It 
And one, I believe it just cures at Apex. Hi, Lightbeam. Hi, Captain Kirk. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoyed it. How are you doing? Uh, let's see. I want this spell. I also don't know what Black Mage spells would start with C. I think that this is maybe an upgraded version of sleep? Or silence, maybe? Give me silence, guy, which isn't very useful. Something a S. Nah, it's way too early in the game to get Comet. It would be ironic if it's confused, Paladin Boris, considering how confused I am trying to read Wingdings. <laughs> Because we won't we actually have learned temper already with our red mage and these are the level four spells I think and temper is a level two spell we picked up Yeah, I don't I don't know what any of this is I don't know something or maybe I mean it seems very likely because that's definitely the second letter is definitely an A and I know that the third letter is definitely a lowercase s because I didn't capitalize Spoonie's name and it's that symbol for the S. So okay we have haste So this is another spell, okay, that starts with a C and it has an E at the end. Okay, that, okay, so this one must be confused. All right, so I think the first one is maybe another sleep spell. The second one is haste, the third one is confuse, and then the fourth one was the Blazaga spell. Or Thundaga, I think. No, that one was Blizzaga. Yeah, this is Blizzaga, Confuse, Haste, and maybe some kind of other sleep spell. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up Haste for my Black Mage as well. the rest of my money. Ooh, what version were you playing, Bear Steak? I had a really fun time with Solo Red Mage, but I played the Game Boy Advance version. <laughs> oh, 
wait, this is Echo Grass. Dude, this is Echo Grass. I know it is. Uh, yeah, I want to buy an ass ton of these. <laughs> So then this must be eye drops. Cool. So now we also have some eye drops and echo grass. Yeah, sleep rut, that's what it is. Oh, you think it was the Game Boy Advance version on with the DS and still have a GBA slide? Yeah, I, I called the other corpses my emotional support corpses when I did that playthrough. It was a lot of fun. The beginning was kind of tough, but I felt like once I got haste and temper, uh, and also once, especially once I became a red wizard and I could learn blink, mm, you can really stack up some good stuff there. Have a good night, Majin. Thank you for joining us. You rest well. Okay, so we have spent a lot of money. We have learned a lot of magic. Don't mind Bob cheering me on in the corner. I am going to hop on our boat, and we are going to go back to the castle that we started this whole shindig at. And we are going to go collect some treasure. Have a good one, Cairo. Thank you so much for joining us. You have a wonderful night, too. And hey, I'll be here tomorrow with this if you're interested in more of whatever this chaos turns out to be. <laughs> I keep trying to run away. But they keep pulling us back in. Da -na 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 -na. It has always cracked me up that you can run away from enemies on the ship. I mean, it would make more sense if you tried to yeet the enemies off the ship. <laughs> like, this is your ship. Why are you running away from the monster? Get them off your ship. Also, why is the, there is a hole in our ship back there, and I really want to know more about that, too. that castle, but maybe there wasn't. Have a good night, Arimas. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Just running away, just running away. Me and my googly-eyed ship running all day. Oh, except for right now, because these are buccaneers and they're worth money. Bonk. Punch. was the correct spot to get to that. Egg! I finally got my friend caged to raid you. <gasps> the Care Bear! Care Bear! Thank you so much for 20 months! Welcome back! Hi! I saw that earlier. Lovely to have you all here. How are you doing today, Care Bear? Yeah! Techie added googly eyes to the uh, 
boat and also I, I think maybe the airship when we eventually get it. Oh wait, I think it's sad. It would be really nice if I could, uh... wait, actually I might be able to decipher which one is Corneria. Cause I know, oh, I know what the letter C is. Oh wait, it, it, is that it? That must be. Corneria. Yeah, that is Corneria. Shoot, I did have it right. Hi, lightsaber. This is the Final Fantasy One Pixel Remaster with Wingdings. Yeah, I'm not very good at remembering where the actual towns are on the map, of course. <laughs> and considering everything's in Wingdings, normally where I could just look at the Pixel Remaster map and go, oh yeah, there it is. I have to decipher it in Wingdings. <laughs> yeah, also uh, our wonderful friend Tekitome made a whole bunch of custom sprites for us for the playthrough. It's really awesome. Right now, we just picked up the elf key a little while ago, so I've been going around collecting all of the various treasures at different parts of the game we've been to. I grabbed all the treasure at the Marsh Cave, all the treasure at Astos's castle, and of course all the treasure in the elf castle. Now we are picking up the stuff at Castle Corneria, and we are gonna go pick up Garland's stuff as well. And then our next stop after that, I believe we'll be going to the... Maybe the Earth Cave? We still have to fight Vampire at some point. Oh, is that the dynamite? That might actually be the dynamite. I don't remember. <laughs> I know that the second letter is not. <laughs> I know the second one is an I. Oh, uh, wait. And then there's a P. Crack, I don't remember what key item that is. What other stuff did we get? Some armor, some daggers. Anything that is worth me equipping. Nope. Ah, yes, of course. Uh, so instead of dynamite, we have ye old explodey sticks. <laughs> of culture. Alright, let's go pick up the stuff at Garland's castle real quick. Since we're here, you know. Barry, 
You've been playing Psychonauts 2 for 10 hours. Oh, dang! <laughs> well, I mean, it sounds like you liked it, but... Man, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Congrats on finishing the game. And yeah, we're still going for a little bit tonight. Um, probably about another half hour. And then we are going to roll over any time remaining on the clock to tomorrow for day two of the subathon. We got a little over four hours left on the clock right now. You did enjoy it greatly. Good, I'm glad to hear that. Oh, also, the surprise that a Chris store had for me was that Techie made us a bunch of custom sprites. We have googly-eyed black mage, ollie white mage, and me versions of monk and red mage. <laughs> oh wait, I think we collected the left side ones already. You totally can, Barry. I'm sure that a Christo would probably be happy to share uh, where he found the files and all that. And I know that once I see what the upgraded sprites are when we change classes, that him and Techie are also going to be releasing the sprites, the Spoonie sprites for anybody who wants to use them. Hey, Lizzie, I'm doing great. How are you doing? Welcome to Final Fantasy Wingdings. I got a sword, maybe? Sword? A sword. That sword was an upgrade. I want to see what it does. Or that. <laughs> Or you just punch that guy to death, no big deal. Stabby sword. Yeah, don't need to read the numbers. Green mean good. Green good. Green go up. Another sword and some some kind of item that I don't know what the hell it is. I have a lot of various swords now. I should probably start vendoring some of them. I'm glad you survived. That's very true. If I play this again with Fighter, so I can see the evolved sprites, we will have a lot of swords. And Fighter does like swords. He likes swords and he don't care who knows. Stabby, stabby. Big muscle guy. So, I think that I have now collected all of the treasure. <laughs> I'm gonna go stay at the end. And then I'm gonna go drive my boat over to the dwarves, because I think that's where I'm supposed to go next. Doing okay? Enjoying your week off of work? You finally be Oh no! Straight to deep worst video gaming ever! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry it was disappointing, Blizzy. 
I hope at least the journey was good. Sure, that's where Mentoy is. Or wait, no, that was no, that's Garland's castle up there, and then Matoya's over there. Was that where I went for the doors? Is that the elf town? Yeah, I think. Is over here to the right. Hi, Trap! How how were the hot nuggets? How are the hot nugs? We bite the nuggets. Egg! Tropic two sparrow hot nugs in my mouth. Tropic two sparrow trop made me do it. Trop made trop made you eat eat things. He made you eat stuff. How dare he? <laughs> JD, thank you for 38 months. Welcome back. Hi, Raiders. Hi. Uh, I feel like y'all probably all know me, but I'm Spoonie, and this is the Wingding version of Final Fantasy 1, and it's, uh, something. It sure is something. Also, yeah, no, this is where we got the ship. I'm all turned around. Jack's dead on your floor. Oh. Well, it's a good thing that you brought a tarp and a baseball bat with you to the airport when you picked him up. You should clean up nice. Hi, Conan Data. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. Uh, all of this is courtesy of a Chris store in Tekitome. The Chris store figured out how to get a hold of all the sprites that are edited and also how to change the font's wingdings. And Techie drew literally like 260 sprites for us. Also, yes, Ollie is the white mage and our boat has googly eyes. <laughs> Does this teach menuing? Uh, yeah. If you can read it, Faye. <laughs> if you can read it. Hi, Rydor. How are you doing? Yeah, basically, Wingding Final Fantasy hey. has been the best Come shit show England. ever. Come on, England? Wait. Shan, did you eat your mic again? <laughs> yeah! Booty loves cheese! Why do you keep eating your microphone? I mean, you have two, but still. <laughs> Yo! Hello! Bright Shadow, thank you so much for 37 months. Master Guard, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. Hi! Hi there, Will Shand Raiders. Hi, I'm Spoonie, and uh, today I am playing Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remastered, except for all of the font is wingdings. So, 
I can't read any of my spells or the names of items or how much health I have or the names of any of the towns or anything like that. It's fine. <laughs> also, one of our lovely community members made custom sprites for our party. So these are also beautiful. Oh, also our boat has googly eyes. <laughs> I can't read it. <laughs> anyway, I play a ton of RPGs and retro games. Um, today is something special. Uh, we are actually doing a three day long subathon celebrating six years of me streaming on Switch. And this is one of the things we unlocked was me playing Final Fantasy 1 and Wing Dings, which originally I had agreed to play it for one day, but. This is so ridiculous that I just want to beat it because think about this. Listen, I'm going to pause the music. This is very important for you to understand. Think about the power move of being able to say that you beat a Final Fantasy game in Wingdings. That's value. <laughs> <laughs> That is the kind of absolute bullshit nonsense I can get behind. So that's exactly what I'm trying to do this weekend is beat Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings. <laughs> Thank you so much for the rain, Shan. I hope you had an awesome day. What were y'all up to? Also, by the way, Bards, if you haven't followed any of our lovely raiders, we've, we've gotten so many freaking raids today. Please go follow Will Shan, go fellow Trap. I just go follow, go follow all of the people, please. Ah, <laughs> uh, shoot. Um, I'm trying to get to the dwarves right now. So far, for those of you who are familiar with Final Fantasy 1, I have defeated Garland. I've been to the Marsh Cave and picked up the crown. I have killed Astoast and gotten the Crystal Eye. I gave that to Matoya. Matoya gave me this cool herb that I gave to the Elf Prince, and he was like, yay, I'm better now, and he gave me a key, and I went around and opened a whole bunch of treasure chests. And now I got an item from one of those treasure chests. It's another key item that I can't actually read what it is, and I don't remember what it is, so mostly I am just making a guess that I need to go back to the dwarves. Also, if you're curious about the subathon, you can type exclamation point subathon for a little more information. But basically, we're streaming three days of subathon. Today, tomorrow, and Sunday. I used to do subathons in one day streaming for like 24 hours, but then I got older and I realized that I hate it because I like sleep. <laughs> so instead, we stream basically until I get too tired and then we pause the timer. I go to bed, I wake up the next day, we stream some more and continue the timer. That'll be this whole weekend. We have a whole bunch of sub goal incentives that you can unlock and uh, if you type Exclamation point seven thought click on the paste bin link. They're all listed there. But adding time is also super duper easy. All new subs, resubs, and gift subs add time to the timer. I think I know when we started we could add a total of 33 hours. I don't know where we're at anymore. I've lost track. My black mage I guess is a boat. Maybe that's the canon Mac Bog, is that it's actually the black mage that turns into the boat, and that's why it has googly eyes. Hi Daniel, hi Just Prom. Hi Jeffy, sleep is good, I agree. So, uh, this is what I assume is Lolly Ho. <laughs> Lolly Ho! There's a dwarf somewhere, I think down here, that wants dynamite from us. And I believe that there's also a room here that I can open with the elf key, if I am not mistaken. Oh, you got some quesadillas. Nice. That sounds good. Whoa. Ollie has decided to fly many circles around me. 
Oh, hey, look, I was right. I have the dynamite, even though it's not spelt as dynamite. I don't know what it's actually called in this version of the game. But we have it. I'm calling the, uh, them the ye old explodey sticks. I am actually having a really good time figuring out what all the wingdings are, Code and Tata. I've been calling Hey Chat sometimes to be like, hey, like, I don't remember where I'm supposed to go next, or hey, can somebody help me? Because figuring out what this spell is is awful. So occasionally I've asked for help, but mostly I just think it's hilarious watching me try to figure this out. <laughs> I would definitely like though, hey chat, what is the actual name of the dynamite in this version of the game? Because I just made a wild guess pulling from my memory that this is where I needed to go next. And I don't actually know what it's called. <gasps> Nitro powder, ah. Yeah, that's why I totally would have never guessed that. <laughs> Yo, awesome sleepy hippo with the honorable Sudoku. Can we get some Fs in the chat? We'll see in 10 minutes, friend. You know it's wingdings, but is it supposed to look like he has googly eyes? Yes. <laughs> On top of the wingdings font, Daniel, we have custom sprites that one of my community members made for the playthrough. How much backseating have I needed so far? Less than I would have thought, actually. <laughs> I did play through Final Fantasy 1 again earlier this year with a single red mage on the Game Boy Advance version. So I've forgotten a few of the order things, but I actually feel like I haven't been doing too shabby for playing a game in Wingdings where I can't read anything. I also don't know what any of the items are when I pick them up. So I kind of just have to look. There's a helmet. Maybe we got another sword. <laughs> oh good, that's an upgrade. What about for you? No. Oh no, that might be a hat that's fighter only. Rip. We have been getting a lot of fighter only equipment, which stinks because I can't do anything with it but sell it. No, why would I lie, Fred? <laughs> Wait, why would I lie about playing Final Fantasy and Wingdings? This is super serious. <laughs> All right, so since we blew that up, now we can move our ship past it and work our way towards the Earth Cave. This is already upsetting. Good, Bombadil, that I'm doing my job right. <laughs> Uh, would you like to know how to say lolly ho in wingdings? That's rally ho. Where's that guy that said lolly ho? I lost him. Anyway, that was rally ho, I think. Yeah, that's rally ho. Or no, that is lolly ho. Never mind, I'm wrong. This is how you say lolly ho in wingdings. Sad face, cancer symbol. Full circle, uh, eight thing that I don't know. Mailbox, waves, big square, pencil. <laughs> I would say that I wish that I had brought a fighter, but also it's really nice not having to worry about gear for my monk at all and being able to vendor this stuff to afford magic. Also, Bob the Cat from Animal Crossing hangs out on the side when we're in a field battle. Pisces, thank you. I'm probably never gonna remember that, so I apologize in advance. That's preemptive strike. Have a good night, Shannon. Thank you for joining us. You rest well. Trap got you bluebell ice cream. What flavor? And I swear you better say homemade vanilla or I'm going to get so mad. <laughs> it was good. Homemade vanilla and French vanilla. That's like, listen, those are the tippity top. 
tippity tippity top. If there were such a thing as strawberry Pop-Tart flavored ice cream, I would buy it, honestly. <laughs> nice, we got a new town. Let's check it out. Hi, Tasty, how are you doing? Does it, does it, is it tasty? Hey, yeah, let's see not. Oh my God. Root beer floats are so good. It's just from, it is a beautiful language. Just play through Final Fantasy 1 in Wingdings and you too can become a master of Wingdings. Be the change in your life that you seek. Be Wingdings Neo. It doesn't matter if people tell you that learning Wingdings is ridiculous and a waste of your time. It's not their lives. It's yours. It's yours. Jay said he's more Southern than me. Bitch, you grew up in New Jersey. <laughs> Starts with a C. Is this this is a Kiraga, is it? I think it is. Yo, that's totally Kiraga. We gotta buy it. And that was literally all of my money. <laughs> There's Firaga. Man, there's so. Oh, man. We're gonna have to vendor stuff because I can't afford all this magic. Yeah, I was, to be fair, fairly, I was sassed first. I was sassed first. I'm just gonna sell anything that we aren't currently equipping because if I'm not wearing it, we don't need it. You see a problem. We named the party Spoonie Can't Read Wingdings, but I'm slowly learning Wingdings. By the end of the game, the names will be a lie. Like all I said, it's okay. It's totally fine. Oh wait, no, I don't need to stay at the end. I just did that. Diaga. I don't know what the spell is. Life, maybe? That's gotta be life. Because light's not a spell. That's gotta be life. Oh, it can't be holy because we can't learn holy until we become white wizards. 
<laughs> I think that's gonna be life. So I'm definitely picking that up. Yeah, Lolly Ho started with sad face. So I'm thinking that must be life, which is good if we pick that up because I currently don't have any Phoenix Downs because I haven't deciphered which thing is a Phoenix Down. <laughs> oh man, and I can't afford any of this stuff even though I sold all the fighter gear. So I think we're gonna have to grind money again. I don't know, Bright Shadow. This all just has spiraled out of control. <laughs> We're all just kind of accidentally learning wingdings. Oh man, those are better gear for our mages. I want to pick those up too. That's true, Chop. That is true. It's 1,700 of points. I will play Garfield Kart. You know, I do want to ask, hey chat, at this point in the game, is trying to get buccaneers to spawn in the water still the best way to farm money? Or is there a better spot now that I'm able to come over here? Silver Hammer is so nice when you only have one white mage, so you don't have to worry about who's fighting over it. <laughs> no! Spooter's back attacked me! I don't want to be surprised by spiders. Ambushed by spiders. News it now. Oh, are there a lot of chests with gold now? I yeah, I don't I don't actually remember. I don't remember at this point in the game, and I can't read what I get from any of the chests, so I have no idea which ones have just had gold in them. Thank you, gambling poet. That is exactly what I was needing. Yeah, we okay on health. This is a very scary looking group. Yo, can we get some S in the chat for Vero for that honorable Sudoku? insulting them, are you? physical only Ryan. I see, sorry, I missed that part. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I feel like it, it'll work if you don't use the spells. 
like you can use a red mage if you don't learn any magic and then you would be forcing physical only on yourself. But you know, at the end of the day, also just play whatever you want to play. Oh yeah, I forgot that this guy is in our way and so we can't go this direction yet. <laughs> I don't have the thing. What if Final Fantasy IV Paladin percent had an incentive for wingdings? Say, I have absolutely no idea how I would do that. Pain. <laughs> I don't know how I would do that. I feel like I feel like that would be a lot of sub points. Have a good night, Rob. Thank you for joining us. I don't think I'm prepared to come here yet. Because if I'm wanting to pick up more magic, like basically once I start walking through the dungeon there, uh, I feel like we're gonna wanna stick around for a while. That's true. We don't 100% know whether or not Pally Percent is doable on the Pixel Remaster. Casey, we have literally no idea. No one has gotten their hands on the game to try the glitches for Paladin Percent, so how would you know? I'm sure as heck gonna try them all. I don't necessarily expect them to work. But I'ma try them. Cause if they do work, then I'm probably gonna speed run it. <laughs> Hi Roba, how are you doing? Yeah, we would have to see whether or not Misgift works. We'd have to see, well technically to run Pally Percent, you don't have to do trash cam, but it is faster, but you definitely have to work. You have to get the misskip to work. Are you talking about the 3D version, Tasty? Because the Pixel Remaster 4 hasn't come out yet, so that's why we're, we're just speculating. We, we really have no idea. Sleepy, how are you? That's true. I don't have to grind for the steel armor. I just have to have enough money for spells. It's very expensive now. Interesting. No one can learn this spell yet. That must be maybe a wizard spell. I know, we're talking about a skip in Final Fantasy IV, which hasn't come out. <laughs> maybe, I don't know, maybe you thought we were talking about Final Fantasy I? Yeah, I was talking about Final Fantasy IV. Yeah. <laughs> no worries, that's why I was confused. <laughs> it's all good. I really can't afford anything else right now. No, nah, it's all good. Yeah, I speedrun Final Fantasy IV Paladin percent, so we were curious whether or not some of the glitches that allow you to speedrun it on Super Nintendo will be 
in the uh, Final Fantasy IV Pixel Remaster. We'll just have to wait and see. Yeah, it comes out September 8th. I'm really excited. Do we get that power stuff from Astos' Mystic Key Treasures? Probably? Um... I mean, I can't actually read any of this, so it's possible that the Black Mage is just wearing it. I think, I think Black Mage is wearing it right now. I think this is it. <laughs> because I know the flag is a P, and that's enough letters to be Power Staff. So I'm pretty sure that this is the Power Staff. <laughs> also, hi, Cloudy. How are you doing today? All right, I am going to stay at the inn. It is, yeah, it is kind of weird, Natagi. It, it threw me off when I played Final Fantasy III that you can move diagonally, but it's also kind of cool. And we're gonna make a save, and it is 1 a.m. So, we are doing a three day long subathon, but I've been live for almost seven hours tonight. We started around six. We have almost four hours left on the clock, and I think I'm going to be saving the rest of that time to start off tomorrow's stream. So, tomorrow, I'm gonna try to start as early as I can. I'm hoping like 4 p.m. Angry Trees and I do need to go shopping a bit before I start stream, so. Hopefully four, obviously no later than six. And we'll also be going late tomorrow and then we'll be starting early and going late on Sunday as well. Every diagonal move your brain's like, wait, that's illegal. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, sometimes I we just have to put down this masterpiece and, and just take a rest and recharge for more tomorrow. It's so powerful that I really just, I can't handle more of it right now, Code and Data. I, I gotta rest. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for hanging out today. I really, really appreciate it. Day one of the subathon has already been amazing. Thank you for all of the support. We've hit two new sub goals for Awesome August. We've made some really good headway into maybe even, you know, maybe hitting our max time eventually. Who knows? Who knows? And we've gotten to play Wingding's Final Fantasy, which is just amazing. 